Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. By switching to McCook National Bank and having a Bison Affinity Card, five cents of every signature-based purchase will be donated to McCook Public Schools. Since inception in July 2017, we have given more than $1,213.70 to McCook Public Schools. By using the Bison Affinity Card, the money raised will go to making McCook Public Schools a better learning center for generations to come. Put one in your wallet today. For more information about the Bison Affinity Card, please call our business number or visit our website. McCook National Bank is an equal housing lender. Member FDIC. Are your cattle stuck by one water tank? Do you have areas in your pasture the cattle won't graze? Then look no further than Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching. You will install new water lines to get your cattle utilizing your entire pasture and putting on more pounds. And we'll repair your existing livestock and irrigation water lines. Whether it be livestock or irrigation water systems, give us a call. Here at Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching, we have decades of experience and warranty our work for two years on new installations. Give us a call at 308-278-2720. We build it right the first time. The all-new Copper Mill Steakhouse, located on the beautiful Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook, Nebraska. Good times with good friends. Just look at this place. Take a look at this lounge. How about this food? Look at this deck. Your hosts, Adam Siegfried and Ryan Fuller, guarantee you a good time with good friends at the Copper Mill Steakhouse on Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook. How is your business doing with brand recognition? Here at Acme Printing, we have lots of promotional products for you to try and receive continual recognition from those who see your name on a product. From pens to flashlights or flash drives to power banks, we have you covered. We also produce logos and websites for many different businesses. Come in today and let us help you find the right product for your business here at Acme Printing of McCook. I graduated high school. A week later, I graduated college with an associate's in business. Now, I'll be able to go to a four-year university entering as a junior. All thanks to the classes I took at Mid Plains Community College. My coursework has almost entirely been online classes. I also took a couple of distance learning classes, which I really liked. And it's very exciting to be able to look forward and see where this will take me. Now, my opportunities are endless. I have significantly reduced my college debt, I save time, I save money, my ceiling is incredibly high. You can do this. Hello and welcome to McCook Bison TV. Right now we have a game between the McCook JV Girls versus the Broken Bow JV Girls. For the McCook starting McCook players, we have Peyton Doucette, number one, Ashley Miller, number three, Brolin Morgan, number ten, Addison Randall, number twenty, Jocelyn Hammond, Number 21, Ainsley Taylor, number 30. Elsa Wilcox, who also plays in varsity, her number is number 31. Faith Rubin, number 31. Grace, Gracie Nelson, 33. Megan Hodgson, 20, 42. Sierra Kochwire, 44. And Kaylee Puckett, number 15. For your Broken Bows uh, lineup, we have number 10, Lauren Ren Reynolds, number 12, Callie White, number 14, Madison Jackson, number 20, Emily Fox, number 21. Gracie Olgen, 22, Kennedy Garcia, 24, Kenna McKelson, 30, Jocelyn Coleman, 34, Emma Custer, and 42, Avery Campbell. Cook Bice and going up for the shot and it was no good. Peyton Doucette for McCook Bice and will be passing the ball in. Passing the ball in to Addison over to Brolin. Swing over to Elsa John oh uh, Peyton, my bad. Back over to Brolin. Or to Addison.
Broken Bow is swinging the ball around, looking all over. And the ball was popped up a little bit, and Broken Bow keeps the ball. Broken Bow is passing around the ball here. Driving in just a little bit, and it's recovered by Elsa Wilcox for McCook Bison. Bowen Morgan struggling in the back half, and there's a little bit of a trip there. And looks like there's a foul on number 25 from uh, Broken Bow. McCook will be passing in the ball. It was Emily Trotter. That's her first. The ball gets thrown out of bounds. But Sierra saves it and Broken Bow recovers the ball. Bringing the ball all the way down court. Up for the three is no good. Broken Bow swats the ball. Looking around, passing the ball. None of her teammates are down low. Broken Bow trying to find an open person here. Broken Bow can't find much movement. Nope. And Sierra from McCook gets the ball, passing it over to Brolin, all the way to Peyton Doucette, over, sent over to Addison, and the ball's hit out of bounds. Ball goes out of bounds on McCook and Broken Bow will pass in the ball. Broken Bow will be passing in the ball here. The score is still 0 0 with 5 minutes 22 seconds left on the clock. McCook uh, passing around the ball here. Brolin Morgan kind of struggling. There's a timeout called on McCook Bison. We'll be back after these sponsors. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. By switching to McCook National Bank and having a Bison Affinity Card, five cents of every signature-based purchase will be donated to McCook Public Schools. Since inception in July 2017, we have given more than $1,213.70 to McCook Public Schools. By using the Bison Affinity Card, the money raised will go to making McCook Public Schools a better learning center for generations to come. Put one in your wallet today. For more information about the Bison Affinity Card, please call our business number or visit our website. Bocook National Bank is an equal housing lender. Member FDIC. Bye. Are your cattle stuck by one water tank? Do you have areas Back in your town? The uh, JV girls basketball. We have the Broken Bow Indians versus McCook Bison. The score's currently two for Broken Bow, none for Bison with four minutes and 45 seconds left on the clock. Addison from McCook's driven the ball all the way down. It's stolen by number 10, Lauren Reynolds from Broken Bow. Gracie tried to shoot it, and the ball was swatted, and there was a jump ball. It's now McCook's ball. Megan Hodgson comes in for Sierra from McCook Bison. As she will be passing in the ball here. Yep, passing over to Peyton Doucette, looking for Addison. Does not decide to pass her, passing it back over to Megan. Passing it back down to Peyton. Dumping it to Elsa, and it's two points for Elsa Wilcox. Broken Bow passing all the way down to Avery, up for the two, and it is good. Avery Campbell with two points. McCook passing in the ball, then losing it. 
Broken bow going up for the shot. Gracie, no good. Megan Hodgson recovers the ball, passing it over to Ashley Miller. Looking for Peyton Doucette. Getting pressured a lot by Broken Bow right now. Fix passing on the ball, shot is up and no good. Broken Bow will come up with the ball here. At number 12, Callie White, rebound to the ball. Number Shots up and no good. Ball get, gets kicked out to number 10, Lauren. Kicks backed out, up for the three, it's no good. Elsa will recover the ball, passing to Megan all the way down court to Addison. Driving in a little bit, can't find anything, tries to pass it to Peyton, and Broken Bow recovers the ball. Number 44, Broken Bow, Caitlin Scott is the point guard. The ball gets passed back out to Caitlin, driving in just a little bit over to Avery, and the two points again for Avery. Campbell. McCook with the ball now. Peyton got a little caught up, but the ball gets passed over to Megan. Passes it to Peyton, over to Addison, over to Ashley Miller. Back over to Peyton to set in, in for Megan, out for Ashley, and the ball is no good. And McCook will recover the ball. Addison goes up for the shot, and there was a foul called on Broken Bow. Number 40. Kaylin Scott. First shot for McCook was no good. We have number 15. Keely Puckett going in for Peyton Doucette and a few subs for Broken Bow. Here comes the second shot. Shots up. It's good. Broken Bow with the ball now. Madison Jackson will pass in the ball for Broken Bow. Looking for teammates and she finds Haley. Getting pressured a lot by McCoy. Cook right now. Pressing ball all the way down, looking for the three. It's no good. Covered by Avery. First shot's up. It's no good. And another shot's up, and it's good for Avery Campbell. The Cook with the ball now. Ashley's kind of struggling a little bit. Megan Hodgson gets the ball, passing it down low to Ansley Taylor. Kelly gets the ball swatted, but recovers the ball again. Ball gets kicked into Megan Hodgson, and it's no good. Broken ball with the ball now. Madison is dribbling down the court. Looking for a teammate some low. Goes up for the three, and it is good. Number 25 for Broken Bow, Emily Trotter. We have some subs for Broken Bow. Number 10 is coming in, Lauren Reynolds, and number 22. Kennedy Garcia. Broken bow with the ball now. Madison passes over to Healy. Broken bow passing around the ball. Yep. Oh. Broken bow try to pass to one of her teammates, but Megan Hodgson gets the ball and takes up for the two, three, two points. Number 22 for Broken Bow. Kennedy Garcia with the two points as her teammate passes it down to her. Elsa Mucker with the ball now. Yep, over to Ainsley, back in for Elsa for the free two points. Broken Bow taking it down the court here. Trying to score before the end of the first with 30 seconds left. Shots up. No good. McCook recovers the ball. Also Wilcox looking for teammate Ashley Miller, but she cannot find the ball. Madison for Broken Bow will have the ball. 
Passing all the way down low for two points, and it is good. Number 25. Uh, 25, Emily Trotter. Emily gets the ball again, and the time runs out. The score is 715. Broken Bow will be back after these sponsors. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. By switching to McCook National Bank and having a Bison Affinity Card, five cents of every signature-based purchase will be donated to McCook Public Schools. Since inception in July 2017, we have given more than $1,213.70 to McCook Public Schools. By using the Bison Affinity Card, the money raised will go to making McCook Public Schools a better learning center for generations to come. Put one in your wallet today. For more information about the Bison Affinity Card, please call our business number or visit our website. Bocook National Bank is an equal housing lender. Member FDIC. Are your cattle stuck by one water tank? Do you have areas in your pasture the cattle won't graze? Then look no further than Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching. You will install new water lines to get your cattle utilizing your entire pasture and putting on more pounds. And we'll repair your existing livestock and irrigation water lines. Whether it be livestock or irrigation water systems, give us a call. Here at Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching, we have decades of experience and warranty our work for two years on new installations. Give us a call at 308-278-2720. We build it right the first time. The all Welcome back to the McCook Bison basketball JV. We have McCook Bison versus Broken Bow Indians. Broken Bow has a ball, but Peyton Doucette recovers the ball, driving in for two points. The score is now 9-15, Broken Bow in the lead by six points. Broken bow, trying to pass the way on the ball here. Broken bow, passing around the ball. Yep, trying to look down low to Emma, but cannot find anything. Ball gets passed back out to Kaylin. Kicks back out, trying to look down low. Couldn't find anything. Shots up, and no good. Sierra recovers the ball from a cook, passing it over to Berlin Morgan, all the way down to Addison. Up for Peyton, it's good. Four points behind from a cook bison. There's a pushing foul called on McCook, I believe number 20. That was Addison's first foul for tonight. Team foul number one for McCook. The ball, ball will go out on McCook. Broken Bow will have the ball. Yep. Callie was trying to pass in the ball to number 25, Emily, but she couldn't find anything. The ball gets passed in to number 40, Kaylin. Pass it back over to Emily. And the, the ball, ball goes out of bounds. Emily couldn't find her teammate. McCook will be passing in the ball. Number no. one, Peyton Doucette will be passing it in. Number three, Haley will be coming in for number 12. Kelly White for Broken Bow. Ashley Miller has the ball, passing it over to Peyton Doucette. Passing it all the way down to Addison. And the ball gets swatted by Haley, and it's McCook's ball. Peyton Doucette will be passing in the ball. Passing over to Addison, trying to look for Ash, can find things. She finds Brolin for the three, and it's no good. Addison recovers the ball over to Sierra for two points. We have a timeout for Broken Bow. We'll be back after these messages. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. 
Welcome to First Central Bank of McCook. Here you get small town service with big city diversity. We strive to meet your every banking need. To further increase your convenience, we have a four lane drive through mobile banking, and 24 7 ATM services. Or let us help you in person at 904 North Highway 83. First Central Bank, let's plan for tomorrow together. Member FDIC. Welcome back to the uh, JV girls basketball. We have McCook Bison versus Broken Bow Indians. Scores currently 15 for Broken Bow, 13 for McCook, with six minutes and 10 seconds left on the clock. Broken Bow with the ball now. The ball gets passed over to number 40, Kaylin, and she cannot find a teammate right now. Passing it over to Emily. Trying to look down to Emma, can't really find much. McCook is putting up some good defense. And there's a foul called on number three, Ashley Miller. That is her first for tonight, team foul number two. Broken ball, we'll be passing on the ball now. The ball gets passed into Kaylin. Over to Emily. Looking down low to Emma, still can't find much. Pass the ball into Emma, up for the two, and it's no good. And Peyton Doucette recovers the ball. Ball gets passed over to Brolin, and there's strong defense right now for Broken Bow. Ball gets passed over to Addison, down low to Sierra, and hits the backboard. Broken Bow recovers the ball. Broken Bow with the ball now. Emily Trotter has the ball right now. Put around for one of her teammates. Ball gets passed in and kicked back out. Shut. And shuts up and it's good. For number 10 for Broken Bow. Number 10, Laura Orn Reynolds. I believe that is her first. McCook with the ball now. And stolen by Broken Bow, Kaylin. And there is a travel call on Broken Bow. McCook will have the ball. Addison passing the ball into Ashley over to Peyton Doucette. And there's a foul called on Broken Bow, I believe. Ansley Taylor from McCook Bison will come in for Ashley Miller, number three. Cook with the ball now. Ball gets passed into Peyton over to Brolin. Trying to look down low to Elsa Wilcox and the ball goes out of bounds. Broken Bow will have the ball. Broken Bow taking it down the court here. Yep, Kaylin Scott passing it over to Justin Coleman. Back over to Kaylin. Looking down low for the two points, can't find anything, gets kicked back out. Broken Bow passing around the ball here. Kaylin. Trying to find an open shot here. Broken, broken Bow is not fun much right now, but Kalen's going up for the three, and it's no good. Brolin Morgan rebounds the ball. Looking for one of her teammates. Finds Peyton Doucette. And back over to Brolin. Down to Addison. Over for Elsa Wilcox. And the ball is no good. She will have two free throws.
Spells on number 10 from Broke Bow. First shot's up and it's good for Elsa Wilcox. Making the score 14 for Bison and 17 for Broken Bow. Three minutes, 30 seconds left. Megan Hutch, and number 42, comes in for number 10, Roland Morgan for McCook Bison. Here comes the second shot here. Shots up. It's no good. Broken Bow will have the ball here. Passing the ball in over to number Five, Justin Coleman, going all the way down, passing it to her teammate, back over to number 21, Gracie, up for the three, and it's no good. Megan recovers the ball, almost goes out of bounds, but passes it over to Peyton Doucette. Looking for her teammates, finds Megan Hodgson over to Ainsley Taylor, back over to Peyton. Over to Elsa Wilcox, up for two, it's no good. Ball is hit by Broken Bow. Broken Bow taking it down the court here. Yep, Jocelyn passes it over to Gracie and a shot up and it's no good. Cook recovers the ball. Peyton just hit, dribbling down. Getting stopped by Broken Bow defenders. Over to Megan, over to Ainsley. To Brolin, down low to Elsa. Picks it back out to Peyton. Over to Ainsley again. The ball gate. Kicked out. It's more, and the shot's up by Addison. The ball's out. Oh, almost goes out. Alice saves the ball, and Broken Bow recovers it. Number four, Sydney. Broken Bow passing around the ball here. Yeah. Number five for Broken Bow, Jocelyn Coleman almost had the hero step, but it's no good. Peyton Set has the ball, passing it down low to Addison, but it's kind of caught up between the two. Defenders. Number 12 for Broken Bow. Callie White will come in for number 4, Sydney. Every Doucette will come in for number 10. I believe that is Lauren Reynolds. Broken Bow will have the ball now. Set comes up with the ball here. Peyton just sets pass it all the way down to Addison Randall all over to Megan for the two, and it's no good. Avery Campbell recovers it for Broken Bow. Number 21, Gracie has it. Ball and stolen by Peyton to set. Going all the way down the court and gets caught up by Broken Bow defenders, and she's called for a travel. Broken Bow will be throwing in the ball. I believe that is. Lindsay as well. Number three, Ashley Miller will come in for number 20, Addison. And number 10, Brolin will come in for 42, Megan from the Cook. One minute, 30 seconds left on the clock. Broken Bow passing the ball here. The ball's kind of loud up in the air. Ashley almost got it, and the ball gets recovered by Broken Bow. And Avery goes up for a shot, and there's a foul called on the court. Number 31, Elsa Wilcox. First shot's up for Avery and it's no good. Here comes the second shot. Shots up, and no good. Number 10, Berlin Morgan will come up with the ball. Peyton Doucette has the ball passing over to Elsa Wilcox, up for two and it's up. The ball goes in. Broken Bow is applying a lot of aggression right now. Trying to set up. Ball gets passed over to Kaylin. Back out to Lindsay, back over to Keelan, and there's a foul called on number three, Ashley Miller. A 
that's for second. Team foul number four. Broken wheel passing on the ball here. Lindsay passes it over to Kaylin, back over to her. Gonna pass it out to Avery. Looking over to Kaylin again. Gets it back out. Trying to find somebody to pass to. Yep. Ball is in Kaylin's hands. Pass it over. Pass it down low to Avery. Up for two, and it's good with the foul. Number 44, Sierra, will come in for Elsa Wilcox, and number 20, Addison, will come in for number three, Ashley Miller. Shots up. And it's no good. No good. Yeah. McCook comes up with the ball here. Yep. Pass over to Bullen, down to Addison. Back over to Elf. Oh, Peyton, I mean. And Ainsley Taylor recovers the ball, passing over to Broke Bow. Over to Johnson. Driving a little bit. Two seconds left on the clock. Shots up. Shots up. And that's good. Number five, Jocelyn Coleman for the final score. That was the first half of the JV Girls Basketball. The score is 16 McCook and 21 Broken Bow. We'll be back after these messages. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. Welcome to First Central Bank of McCook. Here you get small town service with big city diversity. We strive to meet your every banking need. To further increase your convenience, we have a four lane drive through mobile banking, and 24-7 ATM services. Or let us help you in person at 904 North Highway 83. First Central Bank, let's plan for tomorrow together. Member FDIC. Welcome to the sports shop in downtown McCook. Here we have all your Nebraska Husker apparel needs as well as your local McCook Bison. Providing a variety of shoes for men, women, and children in every sport. The sports shop is your store for all things athletic. Come check us out at 208 Norris Avenue. We are the name of the game. The new Anytime Fitness Gym, located at 204 Norris Avenue, downtown McCook, is a prime location if you're looking to improve your strength or health. They are open 24 hours a day, every day. Staffed hours for Monday through Thursday are 8 a.m. to 7 p.m., Friday 8 to 5, and Saturday 9 to 3. Memberships start at $46 a month and include all of their brand new equipment, including a water massage bed and tanning bed. They offer personal training, small group training, and specialized classes, all taught by certified and professional trainers. Stop in today and sign up for a membership. By switching to McCook National Bank and having a Bison Affinity Card, five cents of every signature-based purchase will be donated to McCook Public Schools. Since inception in July 2017, we have given more than $1,213.70 to McCook Public Schools. By using the Bison Affinity Card, the money raised will go to making McCook Public Schools a better learning center for generations to come. Put one in your wallet today. For more information about the Bison Affinity Card, please call our business number or visit our website. Bocook National Bank is an equal housing lender. Member FDIC. Are your cattle stuck by one water tank? Do you have areas in your pasture the cattle won't graze? Then look no further than Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching. You will install new water lines to get your cattle utilizing your entire pasture and putting on more pounds. And we'll repair your existing livestock and irrigation water lines. Whether it be livestock or irrigation water systems, give us a call. Here at Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching, we have decades of experience and warranty our work for two years on new installations. Give us a call at 308-278-2720. We build it right the first time. How is your business doing with brand recognition? Here at Acme Printing, we have lots of promotional products for you to try and receive continual recognition from those who see your name on a product. From pens to flashlights or flash drives to power banks, we have you covered. We also produce logos and websites for many different businesses. 
Come in today and let us help you find the right product for your business here at Acme Print of McCook. When you need care right away, choose McCook Clinic. Take advantage of our urgent care hours Monday through Friday from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Saturday 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. or call for an appointment. McCook Clinic, 308-344-4110. The all-new Copper Mill Steakhouse, located on the beautiful Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook, Nebraska. Good times with good friends. Just look at this place. Take a look at this lounge. How about this food? Look at this deck. Your hosts, Adam Siegfried and Ryan Fuller, guarantee you a good time with good friends at the Copper Mill Steakhouse on Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook. Here at Sainert's Bakery, we are one. So join us today on the bricks in downtown McCook and go Bison! I graduated high school. A week later, I graduated college with an associate's in business. Now, I'll be able to go to a four-year university entering as a junior. All thanks to the classes I took at Mid Plains Community College. My coursework has almost entirely been online classes. I also took a couple of distance learning classes, which I really liked. It's very exciting to be able to look forward and see where this will take me. Now, my opportunities are endless. I have significantly reduced my college debt. I save time, I save money. My ceiling is incredibly high. You can do this. Stop by McCook Lettering for any sports apparel you need. Hours are 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Thursday and Saturday 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Stop in today at 306 Norris Avenue or give them a call at 308-345-4812. Are you ready to change your lifestyle? McCook Clinic's new weight loss program, Ideal Protein, can help you do just that. Like us on Facebook or call for more information. McCook Clinic, 308-344-4110. Here at KRD Federal Credit Union, we offer in-store services with our lobby hours from 9 to 4 and our drive through hours from 8 to 5, Monday through Friday. We now offer home banking 24-7. So you can check your balance, transfer money between accounts, plus our e-banking is easy, secure, and just can't get more affordable. It's free. Come and join the family at KRD Federal Credit Union located at 1001 West B Street in McCook. For more information, visit us at www.krd-fcu.org. We are for people, not profit. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. Welcome to First Central Bank of McCook. Here you get small town service with big city diversity. We strive to meet your every banking need. To further increase your convenience, we have a four lane drive through mobile banking, and 24-7 ATM services. Or let us help you in person at 904 North Highway 83. First Central Bank, let's plan for tomorrow together, member FDIC. Welcome to the sports shop in downtown McCook. Here we have all your Nebraska Husker apparel needs as well as your local McCook Bison. Providing a variety of shoes for men, women, and children in every sport. The Sports Shop is your store for all things athletic. Come check us out at 208 Norris Avenue. We are the name of the game. Our sponsors, Acme Printing Company, McCook Clinic, The Sports Shop, First Central Bank, M&B Bank, KRD Credit Union, Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching, Copper Mill Steakhouse, Anytime Fitness, Garrison's Clothing, McCook Community College, and Sanders Bakery. This live stream will not be available without them. Great game so far. 
Yeah, we see great aggression from both teams right now. Great amount of effort. Yeah, pretty much everyone on everyone scored pretty much on every team. It's even amount of points for like each people. Avery Campbell has the most points for her team. She has three twos so far. No fouls, which is pretty good. And Elsa Wilcox with the most for McCook, scoring three twos with one free throw made and three defensive rebounds and two fouls. The highest fouled person for Broken Bow is uh, Lauren Reynolds with three fouls, I believe. It will be McCook's ball when we start the game. Start the second half here. First two quarters went to be or went by pretty fast. Yeah, ton of scoring, great plays from both teams, and hoping to see more of that this second half. Brolin, McCook. Yep, Brolin Morgan, number 10 from McCook, will pass in the ball. Ball gets passed into Megan Hodgson. Passed over to A Ashley. Back over to Brolin, over to Megan. And the ball gets stolen by Emily for a broken bow. Turn up the volume. I'm talking how I did in the first half, damn it. And there was a foul called on number three, Ashley Miller, for McCook Bison. Broken Emily. bow will have two here. Yeah, Emily misses the first one, but she has another chance for another free throw. Shots up. No good. It's recovered by Megan for McCook Bison. The ball gets stolen by number five for Broken Bow, Justin Coleman. She's trying to look for one of her teammates. Eventually finds Kelly White. They're kind of struggling to find teammates right now that are open. The ball gets passed kind of in the open, but Justin gets the ball. Ball gets passed over to Emily. Broken bow trying to find an open person here. Yep. Emily has the ball right now. Driving in just a little bit, gonna pass out to uh looks like Callie right now. Megan hits the ball and player goes down. And Jocelyn has the ball right now. Kicks it out, back over to Emily. Over to Callie, up for the three, it's no good. Megan Hodgson rebounds the ball. Passing it over to Ainsley Taylor. Oh, passes the ball a little bit too far from Megan. And it will be Broken Bow's ball. Broken Bow pass, passed on the ball there. Jocelyn has the ball passing over to Emily. Passing over to Callie. And the ball gets stolen by Bill Morgan. Driven all the way down the court up for the two and it's no good. Broken Bow recovers the ball. Jocelyn dribbling down the court. Getting pressured a little bit by McCook. Bill Morgan and Megan. Passes the ball on, gonna try to look past to Avery, cannot find anything, pass it over to Jocelyn. The ball gets passed to Callie, over to Emily. Faking the shot a little bit there. 
Avery sets a screen, Emily drives in a little bit, kicks the ball back out to Jocelyn. Broken bow, trying to find a person to shoot. Yep, Emily has the ball, kicks it back out. And the ball gets tipped a little bit by Megan Hodgson from a cook. But we'll have the ball here. Number four comes in for Broken Bow, Sydney, and number 22 comes in, Kennedy. Broken Bow trying to find an open person here. Yeah, Brolin Morgan steals the ball, dribbling all the way down the court, and does not manage to get the two. Also saves the ball from going in. The ball gets passed over to Kennedy, all the way down the court to Avery, but stolen by Ainsley, Ainsley Taylor. Ball gets passed over to Megan Hodgson and to Elsa, and it gets hit by Broken Bow defenders. And number four, Sydney recovers the ball. Over to Kennedy. Over to Avery, and the ball gets blocked by Sierra. She's going to pass over to Brolin Morgan. And the ball gets stolen by Broken Bow Kennedy, and the ball gets swatted by Megan Hodgson. The ball goes out of bounds, resulting in Broken Bow's ball. A few subs come in for McCook. Kelly Pocket. There will be a timeout called for McCook Bison. We'll be back after these messages. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. When you need care right away, choose McCook Clinic. Take advantage of our urgent care hours Monday through Friday from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Saturday 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. or call for an appointment. McCook Clinic. 308-344-4110. When you need care... Welcome back to the JV Girls Basketball. We have Broken Bow Indians with 21 points right now and McCook Bison with 16. It is the third period with 4 minutes and 10 seconds on the clock. With Broken Bow with 21 and McCook with 16. It will be Broken Bow's ball. It will be McCook's ball. Oh, yep, McCook's ball. My bad. The ball gets passed in, and there's a jump ball as Jocelyn goes for the ball. And now it's Broken Bow's ball. Broken Bow passing in the ball. Over to Kennedy, over to Jocelyn, all the way down low to number 34, Madison. And Kennedy gets the ball a little bit dribbling around. Kicks the ball back out to Sydney. Back over to Jocelyn. Kennedy drives in a little bit, kicks the ball back out. And number 10, Lindsay tries to go for a shot, did not get it, but number 34, Madison covers the ball. McCook now recovers the ball. Bill Morgan passes it over to Kaylee Pocket, back over to Barolin. Back over to Kaylee. Down low to 
Greasy and it's no good. Justin will recover the ball for Broken Bow. Passing it down low to Sydney for the two. Cook passing in the ball here. Passing it in to number 15, Kaylee Puckett. Also, Wilcox will pass in the ball from a kick over to Jocelyn. And the ball gets hit and looks like there's a foul called on number five, Jocelyn Coleman. That will be her second foul. That will be her first foul. Her second foul, my bad. The ball gets hit away, and Brolin Morgan recovers the ball over to Kaylee Puckett. Looking all the way over to Jocelyn, and the ball gets recovered by Jocelyn Coleman for a broken bow. And there'll be a foul called on number 10, Brolin Morgan. That's her first. Megan Hodgson comes in for Kaylee Puckett. Number three, Ashley Miller comes in for Jocelyn, and... Number 31, Faith comes in for Elsa Wilcox. Only going in for the two, and it's off the backboard, and ball's no good. First shot is up, and it's good. Good, that's her. First free throw made. Here comes the second shot. Shot's up. It's good. Good, good. She is 2-4 right now for her free throws. Justin has the ball and kind of struggling with the ball a little bit. And Broken Bell recovers the ball. Passing the ball all the way down to Kennedy and she cannot reach the ball. McCook will be passing on the ball here. Yep, number 33. Gracie Nelson. Yep, over to Ashley Miller. Loses the ball a little bit, looking for one of her teammates, finds Gracie. Passing over to Jocelyn. Trying to pass the ball, and there was a foul called on Broken Bow. Number four. That's her first four tonight. McCook passing the ball. Number 21, Jocelyn. Passing, passing it in to number three, Ashley Miller. The ball gets dropped down low to Gracie and gets recovered by number 10, Lauren. Or broke a bow. They missed the inside pass, but still recovered by number four, Sydney. And there's a foul called on McCook. Number three, Ashley Miller. That's their fourth for this game. Shot up. It's good. Few subs come in for both teams. Bola Morgan comes in for Ashley Miller. Enzi Taylor comes in, and I believe Elsa Wilcox came in as well. Shots up. It's good. She is two for two right now. It's good to get your percents high. Percents high for free throws. Lauren. Tries to get the ball, but steps bare, barely out of bounds. Elsa Wilcox will not pass it in from McCook. Passing it over to Brolin Morgan. 
passing it to Ainsley. And misses a shot. Sydney recovers the ball for Broken Bow. Passing it over to Lauren. Over to Jocelyn. Down low to Avery, up 4 2, and it's no good. And there's a jump ball. It's now McCook's ball. Number 44, Sierra will come in for number 31, Faith from McCook. Elsa Wilcox passes in the ball to, over to Megan, back over to Elsa, over to Brolin, and back over to Megan now. Passing all the way down to Enzi Taylor, fakes his shot, goes up for another shot, and goes out of bounds. As it was hit by, it was hit by a broken bow defender, Lorne. McCook passing in the ball now. Over to Megan Hodgson and Jocelyn for Broken Bow recovers the ball, passing over to Emily up for two and it's good. Making the score now 29 Broken Bow and 16 for McCook. Yep. It's now Broken Bow's ball. Number 10, Lauren will be passing the ball. Over to Sydney, up for two, and it's no good. And there's a pushing foul on McCook, I believe. That was on Broken Bow. Broken Bow. Number four, Sydney. It's her second for tonight. McCook also passing in the ball now. Yep. Also, Wilcox has the ball, passing it over to Brolin all the way across the court to Kaylee Pocket. Try to pass it over to Elsa, kind of messed up a little bit, and Brolin has the ball now. Oh, well, I got the ball, pass it over to Ainsley, back over to Brolin. Over to Kaylee on top of the key. Ball's been passed around a little bit. Brolin Morgan has the ball, passing over to Elsa. Over to Kaylee, and the ball gets swatted, and it stays for McCook. Number 34 for Broken Bow. Emery Custer will come in for number 42, Avery Campbell. McCook will have the ball now. The ball gets swatted by number 10, Lauren from Broken Bow, and McCook will have the ball. Ainsley Taylor passes in. Passes it to Sierra, back over to Ainsley, over to Brolin. On top of the three for Kaylee. To Ainsley, over to Elsa, and cannot, Elsa cannot find Sierra down low. So Lauren for Broken Bow will not pass in the ball. 18 seconds left on the clock in the third period. Broken Bow with the ball now. Yep, the ball gets stolen by Ainsley Taylor. Passing it over to Elsa. And she will travel, and it'll be Broken Bow's ball with six seconds left on the clock. Passing the ball in. Over to Justin, and there's and the ball is out of bounds. McCook will have the ball with two, 2.7 seconds left. Merlin Morgan will be passing on the ball here. They have to try to shoot the ball right away. Shots up. It's no good. We'll be back after these messages. Welcome to the sports shop in downtown McCook. Here we have all your Nebraska Husker apparel needs as well as your local McCook Bison. Providing a variety of shoes for men, women, and children in every sport. The sports shop is your store for all things athletic. Come check us out at 208 Norris Avenue. We are the name of the game. How is your business doing with brand recognition? Here at Acme Printing, we have lots of promotional products for you to try and receive continual recognition from those who see your name on a product. From pens to flashlights or flash drives to power banks, we have you covered. We also produce logos and websites for many different businesses. 
Come in today and let us help you find the right product for your business here at Acme Print of McCook. The new Anytime Fitness Gym, located at 204 Norris Avenue, downtown McCook, is a prime location if you're looking to improve your strength or health. They are open 24 hours a day, every day. Staffed hours for Monday through Thursday are 8 a.m. to 7 p.m., Friday 8 to 5, and Saturday 9 to 3. Memberships start at $46 a month and include all of their brand new equipment, including a water massage bed and tanning bed. They offer personal training, small group training, and specialized classes, all taught by certified and professional trainers. Stop in today and sign up for a membership. Here at KRD Federal Credit Union, we offer in-store services with our lobby hours from 9 to 4 and our drive through hours from 8 to 5, Monday through Friday. We now offer home banking 24-7. So you can check your balance, transfer money between accounts, plus our e-making is easy, secure, and just can't get more affordable. It's free. Come and join the family at Carity Federal Credit Union located at 1001 West B Street in McCook. For more information, visit us at www.krd-fcu.org. We are for people, not profit. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. When you need care right away, choose McCook Clinic. Take advantage of our urgent care hours Monday through Friday from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Saturday 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. or call for an appointment. McCook Clinic. 308-344-4111. Here at Sanders Bakery, we are one. So join us today on the bricks in downtown McCook and go Bison! By switching to McCook National Bank and having a Bison Affinity Card, five cents of every signature-based purchase will be donated to McCook Public Schools. Since inception in July 2017, we have given more than $1,213.70 to McCook Public Schools. By using the Bison Affinity Card, the money raised will go to making McCook Public Schools a better learning center for generations to come. Put one in your wallet today. For more information about the Bison Affinity Card, please call our business number or visit our website. Bocook National Bank is an equal housing lender. Member FDIC. Are your cattle stuck by one water tank? Do you have areas in your pasture the cattle won't graze? Then look no further than Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching. You will install new water lines to get your cattle utilizing your entire pasture and putting on more pounds. And we'll repair your existing livestock and irrigation water lines. Whether it be livestock or irrigation water systems, give us a call. Here at Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching, we have decades of experience and warranty our work for two years on new installations. Give us a call at 308-278-2720. We build it right the first time. Stop by McCook Lettering for any sports apparel you need. Hours are 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Thursday and Saturday 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Stop in today at 306 Norris Avenue or give them a call at 308-345-4812. I graduated high school. A week later, I graduated college with an associate's in business. Now, I'll be able to go to a four-year university entering as a junior. All thanks to the classes I took at Mid Plains Community College. My coursework has almost entirely been online classes. I also took a couple of distance learning classes, which I really liked. It's very exciting to be able to look forward and see where this will take me. Now, my opportunities are endless. I have significantly reduced my college debt. I save time, I save money, my ceiling is incredibly high. You can do this. Welcome to First Central Bank of McCook. Here you get small town service with big city diversity. We strive to meet your every banking need. To further increase your convenience, we have a four lane drive through mobile banking and 24-7 ATM services. Or let us help you in person at 904 North Highway 83. First Central Bank, let's plan for tomorrow together. Member FDIC. Sorry about the long break, but we are back for the fourth period. We have Broken Bow with 29 and McCook Bison with 16. Broken Bow will start out with the ball here. Yep, Kennedy has the ball. Passing it over to Lorne. Shots up, that's no good. 
Also Wilcox recovers the ball over to Ashley Miller. Tries to pass the ball and it gets hit off of Jocelyn Coleman's arm. And McCook will pass in the ball now. Also Wilcox passes in the ball to Ashley Miller. Back over to Elsa. Back over to Ashley. And there's some pass back and forth and it gets passed over to Jocelyn. Up for the two and it's good. And there's a timeout called on the court. We'll be back after these messages. Welcome to the sports shop in downtown McCook. Here we have all your Nebraska Husker apparel needs as well as your local McCook Bison. Providing a variety of shoes for men, women, and children in every sport. The Sports Shop is your store for all things athletic. Come check us out at 208 Norris Avenue. We are the name of the game. How is your business doing with brand recognition? Here at Acme Printing, we have lots of promotional products for you to try and receive continual recognition from those who see your name on a product. From pens to flashlights or flash drives to power banks, we have you covered. We also produce logos and websites for many different businesses. Come in today and let us help you find the right product for your business here at Acme Print of McCook. Welcome back after that short break. Kelly White for Broken Bubble passing into Kennedy. Driving all the way down low, passing over to Jocelyn up for two and it's no good. And the ball gets rebounded by Megan Hodgson. Pass it over to Elsa Wilcox, over to Jocelyn from McCook. Driving down a little bit, up for the two and it's no good. And the ball gets hit out of bounds by Broken Bow on off of Callie White's hands. Jocelyn will pass in the ball for McCook. Passing it all the way down low to Ashley Miller by the three. Pass it back out to Jocelyn. Over to Megan Hodgson. It was a little high, but she still got it. Tries to dump it down to Elsa, and it's no good. Kelly throws the ball. Passing it over to Jocelyn. Over to Kennedy. Down to Avery Campbell, and it's up, and it's no good. And there's a foul called on the court. Number 44, Sierra. Broken Bow will have two here. First shot's up and it's good. Here comes the second shot. Shot's up. It's and good. It's good. Cook with the ball now. Also, Wilcox has the ball and kind of passes it into Ashley and gets hit and she covers it and the ball is now at to Jocelyn up for two and it's no good. Recovered by number 12, Callie White for Broken Bow. Jocelyn has the ball for Broken Bow now. Passing it all the way down the court to Avery and it's no good. The ball goes out of bounds and also will be passing it in from a Cook. Megan passes the ball down to Ashley over to Sierra, but Kelly White recovers the ball for Broken Bow, passing over to Jocelyn. And the ball gets tripped up a little bit, and the ball is recovered by McCook. And there's a travel called for McCook. Broken Bow will be passing the ball. We'll have a sub for Broken Bow, number five. Goes out and number 10, Lauren comes in. Gracie comes in for Elsa and Kaylee Puckett comes in for Megan Hodgson. Gracie will pass in the ball for McCook. The ball is passed over to Jocelyn. Over to Ashlyn. It was no good. Goes out of bounds. McCook will have the ball now. Oh 
Gracie Nelson will pass the ball once again for McCook. Passing it over to Jocelyn. Going up for two and it's no good. And Lauren recovers the ball for Broken Bow. Looking all the way down court for Avery and she kind of struggles with the ball a little bit and the ball is called out of bounds. McCook will have the ball now. McCook passing in the ball here. Gracie Nelson passes in to Jocelyn. Passing it back over to Gracie. Down to Ashton Miller. Ashton Miller gets cut up a little bit with Broken Bow defender Kennedy. And there's a foul called on Broken Bow. Foul was called on number 10, Lauren. That is her fourth for tonight. We could okay, the ball here. Yep. Gracie had the ball and it gets tipped off. And Keller covers it for Broken Bow. Emily has the ball. Kennedy sets the screen. The ball gets passed over to Kennedy over to Callie. Going up for two and that's good. I believe those are Callie's first points for tonight. McCook passing in the ball now. Kelly Puckett passes in the ball to Joslyn. And Lauren recovers the ball for Broken Bow. Then Emily recovers the ball. And there's a foul called on McCook. Number 21, Joslyn. That is her first for tonight. Broken Bow will pass in the ball now. Madison will pass in the ball for Broken Bow. The ball gets passed over to Jocelyn. And Gracie goes up for a shot, and it's good. Cook passing in the ball now. And the ball will go out of bounds on McCook. Broken Bow will start with the ball here. Number 10, Lauren, will have the ball now. Passing in for her team over to Gracie up for the two, and it's good. Back to back points for her. Cook with the ball now. Faith passes in to Gracie over to Kaylee Puckett. Dribbling down the court, gets kicked a little bit. And there is a travel called on Broken Bow as she slid with the ball. Also, Wilcox will come in for McCook, subbing for Gracie Nelson. Faith will pass in the ball for McCook. Looking all the way deep for Ashley Miller. Passing over to Megan. Dropping it down low to Elsa. Up for two and it's no good. Ball gets juggled around a little bit but Ashley Miller recovers the ball. Looking for an open spot here. Yep. The ball gets kicked out to Megan for the three, and it's no good. Recovered by Ashley Miller, up for two, and it's good. Broken Bow with the ball now. The score is 37, Broken Bow, 20 for McCook. Four minutes and 10 seconds left on the clock. Madison has the ball for Broken Bow, driving in a little bit, kicks it back out to Gracie. Ball gets passed out to Lauren, up for the two, and it's no good. Recovered by Gracie, up for two again. No good, the ball almost goes out of bounds, but covered by Jocelyn. Broken Bow still with the ball here. Yep. Bout loses it. McCook's kind of struggling to rebound the ball a little bit here. Yep. They need to recover the ball and go down and start scoring. There's a travel called on Gracie from Broken Bow. McCook will have the ball now. Jocelyn swats the ball from McCook's hands and the ball go out on Broken Bow. Also Wilcox will pass in the ball over to Jocelyn. Back over to Elsa over to Jocelyn again. She's trying to look for someone can find anybody, finds Elsa again. They need to get it across the court. 
Over to Brooklyn Bow. Grayson gets the ball up for the two, and it's good. And there is a timeout called on the court. We'll be back after these messages. Welcome to the sports shop in downtown McCook. Here we have all your Nebraska Husker apparel needs as well as your local McCook Bison. Providing a variety of sh- Stop by McCook Lettering for any sports apparel you need. Hours are 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Thursday and Saturday 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Stop in today at 306 Norris Avenue or give them a call at 308-345-4. Welcome back to the uh, JV Girls Basketball. We have Broken Bow Indians with 39 and McCook Bison with 20. Three minutes, 10 seconds left on the clock. McCook will have the ball now. Elsa Wilcox passes in the ball to Jocelyn. John looks for Megan down the middle court, passing over to Ashley. Going to drop it down to Sierra. Try to get the two points, and it's good. Madison will pass in the ball. Over to Gracie, back over to Madison again. Gracie has the ball. That's now over to Lindsay. Back over to Madison. To Gracie. Back over. Again. Might try to pass in. Pass the ball over to Gracie and Jocelyn hits the ball out of bounds. Broken Bell will have the ball now. And he passes in the ball. Over to Lindsay and does not get it. Sierra recovers the ball. Megan Hodgson has the ball now, passing over to Ashley Miller. Dribbling down the court pretty aggressively, passing over to Sierra up for the two, and it's good. Broken ball will be passing in the ball now. At Madison passing over the ball to Gracie, back over to Madison once again. Ball gets stolen by Jocelyn, going up for the fast break up for two points, and it's good. Cook is scoring pretty quick right now. One minute, 55 seconds left on the clock. The ball gets passed over to number 24, Gaia. Over to Gracie. Driving in a little bit, trying to get the ball up, and it's no good. There's a foul called on McCook. Number three, Ashley Miller. Shots up. That's good. Number 21, Greasy. Faith comes in from a cook up for Sierra. One more shot for Greasy. Here is the second shot. Here's it. It's up. It's no good. Jocelyn recovers the ball for McCook. Passing the ball over to Megan, over to Gracie. Going up for the two, and it's good. Gracie Nelson with the two. Madison will pass the ball for Broken Bow over to Gracie. Trying to look down low for one of her teammates. It's not finding anything. He's going to have to pass over the ball over to Madison. The ball gets passed down low to Gracie, and it gets swatted a little bit. That's nice a ball, and the ball's around, and there's a timeout called on Broken Bow. We'll be back after these messages. I graduate. Stop by McCook Lettering for any sports apparel you need. Hours are 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Thursday, and Saturday 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Stop in today at 306 Norris Avenue, or give them a call at 308-345-4. I graduated high school. A week later, I graduated college with an associate's in business. Now, I'll be able to go to a four-year university entering as a junior. All thanks to the classes I took at Mid Plains Community College. My coursework has almost entirely been online classes. I also took a couple of distance learning classes, which I really liked. It's very exciting to be able to look forward and see where this will take me. Now, my opportunities are endless. 
I have significantly reduced my college debt. I save time, I save money. My ceiling is incredibly high. You can do this. Welcome back to the girls JV basketball. We have Broken Bow with 40 points and McCook Bison with 28. One minute, 13 seconds left on the clock. It is now Broken Bow's ball. Madison Jackson will pass, pass it in for Broken Bow. Broken Bow trying to find an open person here. Finds Emery and then finds Jocelyn over to Madison. Over to Kaya, over to Jocelyn again, driving in just a little bit, passing it down low to Kaya and doesn't find anything. Megan gets pressured a little bit by Jocelyn from Broken Bow. And Elsa is caught up in a little bit of a struggle. Oh, Kaylee, I mean. And Jocelyn gets the ball up for two and it's good. McCook with the ball now here. Passing over to Jocelyn, 35 seconds left on the clock. McCook passes it over to Kelly Pocket. Passing it back over to Megan. And for Gracie, over to Jocelyn, over to Megan once again, up for the three. That's no good. Madison will cover the ball for Broken Bow. Jocelyn has the ball, pass it over to Madison Jackson. Driving a little bit, going up, and it's swatted by Megan Hodgson. Megan passes the ball across court to Kaylee. Two seconds left. Passing it down to Gracie. Up for the two. And it's no good. That was your JV girls game. Broken Bow with 42 points. And McCook Bison with 28. We'll be back for the girls varsity game. I graduated high school. A week later, I graduated college with an associate's in business. Now, I'll be able to go to a four-year university entering as a junior. All thanks to the classes I took at Mid Plains Community College. My coursework has almost entirely been online classes. I also took a couple of distance learning classes, which I really liked. It's very exciting to be able to look forward and see where this will take me. Now my opportunities are endless. I have significantly reduced my college debt. I save time, I save money. My ceiling is incredibly high. You can do this. The new Anytime Fitness Gym, located at 204 Norris Avenue, downtown McCook, is a prime location if you're looking to improve your strength or health. They are open 24 hours a day, every day. Staffed hours for Monday through Thursday are 8 a.m. to 7 p.m., Friday 8 to 5, and Saturday 9 to 3. Memberships start at $46 a month and include all of their brand new equipment, including a water massage bed and tanning bed. They offer personal training, small group training, and specialized classes, all taught by certified and professional trainers. Stop in today and sign up for a membership. Are you ready to change your lifestyle? McCook Clinic's new weight loss program, Ideal Protein, can help you do just that. Like us on Facebook or call for more information. McCook Clinic, 308-344-4110. Here at KRD Federal Credit Union, we offer in-store services with our lobby hours from 9 to 4 and our drive through hours from 8 to 5, Monday through Friday. We now offer home banking 24-7. So you can check your balance, transfer money between accounts, Plus, our e-making is easy, secure, and just can't get more affordable. It's free. Come and join the family at Carity Federal Credit Union located at 1001 West B Street in McCook. For more information, visit us at www.krd-fcu.org. We are for people, not profit. When you need care right away, choose McCook Clinic. Take advantage of our urgent care hours Monday through Friday from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Saturday 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. or call for an appointment. McCook Clinic. 308-344-4110. The all-new Copper Mill Steakhouse, located on the beautiful Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook, Nebraska. Good times with good friends. Just look at this place. Take a look at this lounge. How about this food? Look at this deck. Your hosts, Adam Siegfried and Ryan Fuller, guarantee you a good time with good friends at the Copper Mill Steakhouse on Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook. By switching to McCook National Bank and having a Bison Affinity Card, five cents of every signature-based purchase will be donated to McCook Public Schools. Since inception in July 2017, we have given more than $1,213.70 to McCook Public Schools. By using the Bison Affinity Card, the money raised will go to making McCook Public Schools a better learning center for generations to come. Put one in your wallet today. 
For more information about the Bison Affinity Card, please call our business number or visit our website. Bocook National Bank is an equal housing lender. Member FDIC. How is your business doing with brand recognition? Here at Acme Printing, we have lots of promotional products for you to try and receive continual recognition from those who see your name on a product. From pens to flashlights or flash drives to power banks, we have you covered. We also produce logos and websites for many different businesses. Come in today and let us help you find the right product for your business here at Acme Print of McCook. Are your cattle stuck by one water tank? Do you have areas in your pasture the cattle won't graze? Then look no further than Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching. You will install new water lines to get your cattle utilizing your entire pasture and putting on more pounds. And we'll repair your existing livestock and irrigation water lines. Whether it be livestock or irrigation water systems, give us a call. Here at Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching, we have decades of experience and warranty our work for two years on new installations. Give us a call at 308-278-2720. We build it right the first time. Welcome to First Central Bank of McCook. Here you get small town service with big city diversity. We strive to meet your every banking need. To further increase your convenience, we have a four lane drive through mobile banking, and 24 7 ATM services. Or let us help you in person at 904 North Highway 83. First Central Bank, let's plan for tomorrow together. Member FDIC. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. Welcome to the Sports Shop in downtown McCook. Here we have all your Nebraska Husker apparel needs as well as your local McCook Bison. Providing a variety of shoes for men, women, and children in every sport. The Sports Shop is your store for all things athletic. Come check us out at 208 Norris Avenue. We are the name of the game. Here at Sanders Bakery, we are one. So join us today on the bricks in downtown McCook and go Bison! Stop by McCook Lettering for any sports apparel you need. Hours are 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Thursday and Saturday 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Stop in today at 306 Norris Avenue or give them a call at 308-345-4812. I graduated high school. A week later, I graduated college with an associate's in business. Now, I'll be able to go to a four-year university entering as a junior. All thanks to the classes I took at Mid Plains Community College. My coursework has almost entirely been online classes. I also took a couple of distance learning classes, which I really liked. It's very exciting to be able to look forward and see where this will take me. Now, my opportunities are endless. I have significantly reduced my college debt, I save time, I save money, my ceiling is incredibly high. You can do this. The new Anytime Fitness Gym, located at 204 Norris Avenue, downtown McCook, is a prime location if you're looking to improve your strength or health. They are open 24 hours a day, every day. Staffed hours for Monday through Thursday are 8 a.m. to 7 p.m., Friday 8 to 5, and Saturday 9 to 3. Memberships start at $46 a month and include all of their brand new equipment, including a water massage bed and tanning bed. They offer personal training, small group training, and specialized classes, all taught by certified and professional trainers. Stop in today and sign up for a membership. Are you ready to change your lifestyle? McCook Clinic's new weight loss program, Ideal Protein, can help you do just that. Like us on Facebook or call for more information. McCook Clinic, 308-344-4110. Here at KRD Federal Credit Union, we offer in-store services with our lobby hours from 9 to 4 and our drive through hours from 8 to 5, Monday through Friday. We now offer home banking 24-7, so you can check your balance, transfer money between accounts, plus our e-making is easy, secure, and just can't get more affordable. It's free. Come and join the family at KRD Federal Credit Union located at 1001 West B Street in McCook.
For more information, visit us at www.krd-fcu.org. We are for people, not profit. When you need care right away, choose McCook Clinic. Take advantage of our urgent care hours Monday through Friday from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Saturday 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. or call for an appointment. McCook Clinic, 308-344-4110. The all-new Copper Mill Steakhouse, located on the beautiful Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook, Nebraska. Good times with good friends. Just look at this place. Take a look at this lounge. How about this food? Look at this deck. Your hosts, Adam Siegfried and Ryan Fuller, guarantee you a good time with good friends at the Copper Mill Steakhouse on Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook. By switching to McCook National Bank and having a Bison Affinity Card, five cents of every signature-based purchase will be donated to McCook Public Schools. Since inception in July 2017, we have given more than $1,213.70 to McCook Public Schools. By using the Bison Affinity Card, the money raised will go to making McCook Public Schools a better learning center for generations to come. Put one in your wallet today. For more information about the Bison Affinity Card, please call our business number or visit our website. Bocook National Bank is an equal housing lender. Member FDIC. How is your business doing with brand recognition? Here at Acme Printing, we have lots of promotional products for you to try and receive continual recognition from those who see your name on a product. From pens to flashlights or flash drives to power banks, we have you covered. We also produce logos and websites for many different businesses. Come in today and let us help you find the right product for your business here at Acme Printing of McCook. Are your cattle stuck by one water tank? Do you have areas in your pasture the cattle won't graze? Then look no further than Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching. You will install new water lines to get your cattle utilizing your entire pasture and putting on more pounds. And we'll repair your existing livestock and irrigation water lines. Whether it be livestock or irrigation water systems, give us a call. Here at Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching, we have decades of experience and warranty our work for two years on new installations. Give us a call at 308-278-2720. We build it right the first time. Welcome to First Central Bank of McCook. Here you get small town service with big city diversity. We strive to meet your every banking need. To further increase your convenience, we have a four lane drive through mobile banking and 24 seven ATM services. Or let us help you in person at 904 North Highway 83. First Central Bank, let's plan for tomorrow together. Member FDIC. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. Welcome to the sports shop in downtown McCook. Here we have all your Nebraska Husker apparel needs as well as your local McCook Bison. Providing a variety of shoes for men, women, and children in every sport. The Sports Shop is your store for all things athletic. Come check us out at 208 Norris Avenue. We are the name of the game. on the bricks in downtown McCook and go Bison! Stop by McCook Lettering for any sports apparel you need. Hours are 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Thursday and Saturday 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Stop in today at 306 Norris Avenue or give them a call at 308-345-4812. I graduated high school. A week later, I graduated college with an associate's in business. Now, I'll be able to go to a four-year university entering as a junior. All thanks to the classes I took at Mid Plains Community College. My coursework has almost entirely been online classes. I also took a couple of distance learning classes, which I really liked. It's very exciting to be able to look forward and see where this will take me. Now, my opportunities are endless. I have significantly reduced my college debt. 
I save time, I save money, my ceiling is incredibly high. You can do this. The new Anytime Fitness Gym, located at 204 Norris Avenue, downtown McCook, is a prime location if you're looking to improve your strength or health. They are open 24 hours a day, every day. Staffed hours for Monday through Thursday are 8 a.m. to 7 p.m., Friday 8 to 5, and Saturday 9 to 3. Memberships start at $46 a month and include all of their brand new equipment, including a water massage bed and tanning bed. They offer personal training, small group training, and specialized classes, all taught by certified and professional trainers. Stop in today and sign up for a membership. Are you ready to change your lifestyle? McCook Clinic's new weight loss program, Ideal Protein, can help you do just that. Like us on Facebook or call for more information. McCook Clinic, 308-344-4110. Here at KRD Federal Credit Union, we offer in-store services with our lobby hours from 9 to 4 and our drive through hours from 8 to 5, Monday through Friday. We now offer home banking 24-7. So you can check your balance, transfer money between accounts, Plus, our e-making is easy, secure, and just can't get more affordable. It's free. Come and join the family at Carity Federal Credit Union located at 1001 West B Street in McCook. For more information, visit us at www.krd-fcu.org. We are for people, not profit. When you need care right away, choose McCook Clinic. Take advantage of our urgent care hours Monday through Friday from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Saturday 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. or call for an appointment. McCook Clinic. 308-344-4110. The all-new Copper Mill Steakhouse, located on the beautiful Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook, Nebraska. Good times with good friends. Just look at this place. Take a look at this lounge. How about this food? Look at this deck. Your hosts, Adam Siegfried and Ryan Fuller, guarantee you a good time with good friends at the Copper Mill Steakhouse on Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook. By switching to McCook National Bank and having a Bison Affinity Card, five cents of every signature-based purchase will be donated to McCook Public Schools. Since inception in July 2017, we have given more than $1,213.70 to McCook Public Schools. By using the Bison Affinity Card, the money raised will go to making McCook Public Schools a better learning center for generations to come. Put one in your wallet today. For more information about the Bison Affinity Card, please call our business number or visit our website. McCook National Bank is an equal housing lender. Member FDIC. How is your business doing with brand recognition? Here at Acme Printing, we have lots of promotional products for you to try and receive continual recognition from those who see your name on a product. From pens to flashlights or flash drives to power banks, we have you covered. We also produce logos and websites for many different businesses. Come in today and let us help you find the right product for your business here at Acme Printing of McCook. Are your cattle stuck by one water tank? Do you have areas in your pasture the cattle won't graze? Then look no further than Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching. You will install new water lines to get your cattle utilizing your entire pasture and putting on more pounds. And we'll repair your existing livestock and irrigation water lines. Whether it be livestock or irrigation water systems, give us a call. Here at Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching, we have decades of experience and warranty our work for two years on new installations. Give us a call at 308-278-2720. We build it right the first time. Welcome to First Central Bank of McCook. Here you get small town service with big city diversity. We strive to meet your every banking need. To further increase your convenience, we have a four lane drive through mobile banking, and 24 7 ATM services. Or let us help you in person at 904 North Highway 83. First Central Bank, let's plan for tomorrow together. Member FDIC. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in Cook. Welcome to the sports shop in downtown McCook. Here we have all your Nebraska Husker apparel needs as well as your local McCook Bison. Providing a variety of shoes for men, women, and children in every sport. The Sports Shop is your store for all things athletic. Come check us out at 208 Norris Avenue. We are the name of the game.
Here at Sainert's Bakery, we are one. So join us today on the bricks in downtown McCook and go Bison! Stop by McCook Lettering for any sports apparel you need. Hours are 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Thursday and Saturday 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Stop in today at 306 Norris Avenue or give them a call at 308-345-4812. I graduated high school. A week later, I graduated college with an associate's in business. Now, I'll be able to go to a four-year university entering as a junior. All thanks to the classes I took at Mid Plains Community College. My coursework has almost entirely been online classes. I also took a couple of distance learning classes, which I really liked. It's very exciting to be able to look forward and see where this will take me. Now, my opportunities are endless. I have significantly reduced my college debt, I save time, I save money, my ceiling is incredibly high. You can do this. The new Anytime Fitness Gym, located at 204 Norris Avenue, downtown McCook, is a prime location if you're looking to improve your strength or health. They are open 24 hours a day, every day. Staffed hours for Monday through Thursday are 8 a.m. to 7 p.m., Friday 8 to 5, and Saturday 9 to 3. Memberships start at $46 a month and include all of their brand new equipment, including a water massage bed and tanning bed. They offer personal training, small group training, and specialized classes, all taught by certified and professional trainers. Stop in today and sign up for a membership. Are you ready to change your lifestyle? McCook Clinic's new weight loss program, Ideal Protein, can help you do just that. Like us on Facebook or call for more information. McCook Clinic, 308-344-4110. Here at KRD Federal Credit Union, we offer in-store services with our lobby hours from 9 to 4 and our drive through hours from 8 to 5, Monday through Friday. We now offer home banking 24-7, so you can check your balance, transfer money between accounts, plus our e-making is easy, secure, and just can't get more affordable. It's free. Come and join the family at KRD Federal Credit Union located at 1001 West B Street in McCook. For more information, visit us at www.krd-fcu.org. We are for people, not profit. When you need care right away, choose McCook Clinic. Take advantage of our urgent care hours Monday through Friday from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Saturday 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. or call for an appointment. McCook Clinic, 308-344-4110. The all-new Copper Mill Steakhouse located on the beautiful Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook, Nebraska. Good times with good friends. Just look at this place. Take a look at this lounge. How about this food? Look at this deck! Your hosts Adam Siegfried and Ryan Fuller guarantee you a good time with good friends at the Copper Mill Steakhouse on Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook. Whenever you're ready. All right, welcome to uh, Varsity Girls Basketball. Tonight's gonna be McCook versus Broken Bow. Uh, my name is Ian Reynolds. Uh, also announcing the team tonight is going to be Davin Brunswick. He's not here at the moment. He'll be making a return here pretty soon. Starting for the McCook Bison, it's going to be number two, or sorry, number 52, Jacia Hansen. Number 50, Mackenzie Smith. Number 33, Livia Wire. Number five, Brooke Stewart. And number four, Tierra Matson. Starting for Broken Bow is going to be Number 12, Callie Staples. Number 14, Alyssa Cyborin. Number 23, Majesta Velasic. Number 34, Madison Neely. And, sorry, Neely. And number 40, Kaylin Scott. Should be a pretty good game tonight. Bison running, up, running through their starting lineups at the moment. We are going to be keeping track um, as best as we can of some stats tonight. So after halftime, we'll have some um, stats for you guys. Uh, 
All right, both teams getting ready to get out there on the court and uh, start this ball game. All right, getting ready for the tip-off here. Up goes the ball. And it looks like it's going to be Bison. Uh, Matson takes it the three-point line. Looking to pass here. Gets it to number 33. Um, Olivia Wire gets it over to Brooke Stewart. Back over to Smith. Tries to get it to Hanson, but does not do so. Now it's going to be Indians ball going down the court. And they try to make a pass, but Bison get it back. Olivia Wire coming down the court here, looking for a layup, and she puts it up. Goes in and out of the basket. No good. It looks like that's going to be out of bounds on McCook, so it's going to be Indians ball here. All right, Staples bringing it down here. Gets it to Velasic. Now over to Scott. Gives it back to Velasic, but the pass is incomplete. Ball was the ball, but uh, Velasic ends up getting it back. Now over to Staples. Now number 24 shoots it. Three-pointer does n it is not good. They get the rebound, though. Number 12 puts it up. Also a three-pointer, no good. Gets it back, goes in for a layup. No good once again, and Bison finally recover it. Ball gets over to Olivia Wire. She's bringing it down the court. Gets it over to Stewart. Stewart dribbles it in. Looking to get a shot off here. Back top of the key here to Matson. Now back over to Wire. Brooks going to take a three-point shot off the rim. No good. And now it's going to be Indians ball. And number 24, Scott puts it up. And he gets a f draws a foul out of there. Number 40 comes in for number 23 on the broken bow side. Now Velasic puts it up, and that's going to be good. Early lead, 3-0. Indians over McCook here. Bison getting up the court here. Gets a, try to get it to Stewart down the court, but bobbles the ball, and the Indians get it back. Number 40 of the Indians puts it up. Three-pointer. Bounces around the rim. Ends up going in. Bison bring it back in. Gets it over Smith and back to Wire. That's going to draw a foul. Looks like, looks like that's going to be on number 24, uh, Kaya Scott of the Broken Bow Indians. Now Brooke Stewart goes out as uh, Peyton Doucette comes in for the Bison. Olivia Wire gets it into Doucette and looks like that's going to draw a foul. Looks like that's going to be a number 25, Emily Trotter of uh, Broken Bow. Wire looking to pass it in here. Gets it over to Smith. Top of the key here. Gets it over to Doucette. Now back to Wire. Gets it back into Smith. Looking to get a layup here. And they're going to call a charge on um, McKenzie Smith there of the Bison. Broken Bow bringing it down here. Top of the key, looking to get it inside somewhere. Now Smith gets uh, the ball, intercepts a pass there. Now Matson of the Bison looking to dribble it up here. Ball was the ball. Broken Bow gets it back. Now number 34, Neely taking it down. Gets number 40. She's going to shoot a three off the rim. No good. And Tara Matson's going to get the rebound.
Now, J.C. Hansen passes it back up to wire top of the key, shoots it no good. Now broke a bow top of the key here. Number 34 is gonna take the three point shot and that's gonna be no good. And Olivia Wire is gonna get the rebound off that one. She's gonna put it up, no good. Now Broken Bow trying to make something happen, takes a three point shot in and out of the basket, no good. Now do set here for the Bison. And the getting in the hands on the inside, she's gonna take the shot and draws a foul, so she's gonna be shooting two points here. First shot is going to be good. Puts up the second shot off the rim, no good. Indians. Get it on the inside there, take a shot, no good. JC Hansen with the rebound. Now Doucette brings it down. Back up to wire, top of the key, taking a three point shot, that's gonna be good. All right, Indians try to make something happen here. Number 12 takes a three-point shot, no good. Now it's gonna be McCook Bison's ball. Emma Keller and um, Emma Keller and number 20 of the Bison come in. Olivia Wire bringing it down here for the Bison. Puts up the layup and that's gonna be good. All right, Oglal or Broken Bow Indians bringing it down here. Number 12, top of the key, trying to make something happen. Gets it over to number 24. Back to 12 now. Over to 20, back to 12. Now over to number 23. She's going to take the three point shot. No good off the rim. And McKellar with the rebound. Now Olivia Wire bring it back in for the another layup, and she's gonna nail that one. Now and you try to take a three-point shot, but it's gonna be blocked by Olivia Wire. Now once again, Olivia Wire bringing it down, gets it into number one, Peyton Doucette. She's gonna put it up for two. Indians put up a three-point shot. That's going to be no good. They get the rebound, though. Number 23 looking to shoot. Doesn't do so. Takes one step in, puts it up, and that's going to be good for two points. All right, Bison, we're going to take a timeout here. And we are going to take a short advertisement break, and we will be By right switching back. switching to all-new Copper Mill Steakhouse, located on the beautiful Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook, Nebraska. Good times with good friends. Just look at this place. Take a look at this lounge. How about this food? Look at this deck. Your hosts, Adam Siegfried and Ryan Fuller, guarantee you a good time with good friends at the Copper Mill Steakhouse on Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook. By switching to McCook National Bank and having a Bison Affinity Card, five cents of every signature-based purchase will be donated to McCook Public Schools. 
Since inception in July 2017, we have given more than $1,213.70 to McCook Public Schools. All right, welcome back. Uh, Bison with a lead 10 to 8 over Broken Bow Indians. Meanwhile, passing in here to number 50, uh, Mackenzie Smith. Now back over to Keller, back over to Smith now. Now over to Peyton Doucette. Looks over to pass to Brooke Stewart. She puts it up, and that's going to be no good. Now J.C. Hansen comes in for number 50, Mackenzie Smith. Brooke Stewart looking to pass in the ball here for the McCook Bison. Finds Peyton Doucette at the top of the key, gets it over to number 20. And they're going to bobble the pass, and the Indians are going to recover. And they're going to call a foul on Peyton Doucette there, a little push. All right, Indians pass it in here. Of Lesick passes it um, over to Scott. Back over to Velasic now. Now over back to Scott. Now Velasic again. Now up to number 40, Cyborin. And it goes off the hands of Scott, and that's going to be out of bounds. <coughs> All right, Doucette looking to pass ball in here for the Bison. Finds Emma Keller. Now over to J.C. Hansen. Stewart and off Stewart's hands. Oglala's going to, er, sorry, not Oglala, Broken Bow is going to get the ball back. Now Cyborin takes the shot, three-point shot off the rim, no good. Keller's going to get the rebound on that one. All right, Doucette, top of the key here. Set looking to pass. Gets into Jacia, now back over to Keller. Now back to Jacia, not the best pass. Broken Bow gets the ball back off of that one. Now Scott bringing the ball down here. Now Velasic coming in. And number 40, Kalen Scott puts the ball up. No good. Uh, Doucette is going to get the rebound off of that one. Stewart gets over to Doucette. Takes a two-point shot. No good off the rim. And that's going to be it for the first quarter of play. And tonight's matchup versus uh, Broken Bow Indians and the McCook Bison. We're going to take a short break here, listen to our advertisements, and we will be right back with McCook Bison TV. By using the Bison Affinity Card, the money raised will go to making McCook Public Schools a better learning center for generations to come. Put one in your wallet today. For more information about the Bison Affinity Card, please call our business number or visit our website. McCook National Bank is an equal housing lender. Member FDIC. How is your business doing with brand recognition? Here at Acme Printing, we have lots of promotional products for you to try and receive continual recognition from those who see your name on a product. From pens to flashlights or flash drives to power banks, we have you covered. We also produce logos and websites for many different businesses. Come in today and let us help you find the right product for your business here at Acme Printing of McCook. Are your cattle stuck by one water tank? Do you have areas in your pasture the cattle won't graze? Then look no further than Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching. You will install new water lines to get your cattle utilizing your entire pasture and putting on more pounds. And we'll repair your existing livestock and irrigation water lines. Whether it be livestock or irrigation water systems, give us a call. Here at Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching, right, we have decades of experience and warranty our work for two here, years on new installations. Give us a call at 308-278-2720. We build it right the first Lassie time. Has the ball, gets it over to Welcome to First Staples. Central Bank of McCook. Staples back over to Velasic. Here you get small town service with big city diversity. Making a lot of we passes, strive to meet you Velasic every bank takes a three-point shot, no good. Number to further increase your convenience, we have a four-lane drive-through, mobile 12. banking, and 24-7 uh, ATM services. A two -point shot and that's gonna be or let us help you in person at 904 North Highway 83. 
First Central Bank, let's plan for tomorrow together. Member FDIC. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during your business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in Wicca. Takes a three-point shot. She's going to nail it. Welcome to the sports shop in downtown McCook. Here we have all your Nebraska Husker apparel needs as well as your local McCook Bison. Providing a variety of shoes for men, women, and children in every sport. The sports shop is your store for all things athletic. Come check us out at 208 Norris Avenue. We are the name of the game. Hiya Scott, bringing the ball down here. Kaylin Scott. Now back to the last. Kaya Scott gets it over to Kaylin Scott. Now back over to Kaya. And she's going to take the three pointer shot, misses it. And goes out of bounds. Here at Sainert's Bakery, Bison we are now. one. So join us today on the Bricks in downtown McCook and go Bison! Stop by McCook Lettering for any sports apparel you need. Hours are 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Thursday and Saturday 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Stop in today at 306 Norris Avenue or give them a call at... The Indians get their hand on the ball and uh, get it right up for two points there. And I think she's going to be fouled as well. So she's going to be t shooting two shots here. Or, sorry, one shot. All right, Vlasic putting up the shot here. And off the rim, no good. JC Hansen's going to get the rebound. All right, Smith gets it over to Hansen. Now Smith is going to take it inside. She's going to be fouled as she puts up the shot. Shot's going to be no good. She's going to be sh shooting two shots here. She is going to miss her first shot. Stewart comes in for deuce set on the Bison side. Smith taking her final shot here, puts it up, and that's going to be no good as well. And I believe Hanson got the rebound there. Now Smith has the ball. Brooke Stewart putting up a shot, no good. Indians take it down, but Bison get it back. All right, now Hanson on the inside here. Gives it to Smith. Smith takes a dribble, puts it up. Off the rim, no good. All right, going to be Broken Bow's ball here. Kalen Scott getting it in here for the Indians. Staples going to bring it down the court. Wire going to meet her at half court. Now Velasic has the ball looking for a teammate to give it to. Finds number 44. Cyborg. Cyborn, sorry. Puts up the shot. No good. Jesse is going to get the rebound. And that's going to be over and back on Broken Bow. So that's going to be Bison's ball. All right, Wire gets it in to Matson. Matson gets it over to Stewart now to Wire. Now Wire puts it up, no good. And that's gonna be out of bounds on the Indians. Bison ball once again.
All right, Wire gets it in here to Hansen. And Hansen passes it, but it's going to be tipped off by the Indians. Now number 40, Kaylin Scott putting it up for two for the Indians. That's now a timeout um, for the Bison. So we're going to take another advertisement break. We'll be right back with McCook Bison TV. 308-345-4812. I graduated high school. A week later, I graduated college with an associate's in business. Now, I'll be able to go to a four-year university entering as a junior. All thanks to the classes I took at Mid Plains Community College. My coursework has almost entirely been online classes. I also took a couple of distance learning classes, which I really liked. It's very exciting to be able to look forward and see where this will take me. Now my opportunities are endless. I have significantly reduced my college debt. I save time, I save money. My ceiling is incredibly high. You can do this. The new Anytime Fitness Gym, located at 204 Norris Avenue, downtown McCook, is a prime location if you're looking to improve your strength or health. They are open 24 hours a day, every day. Staffed hours for Monday through Thursday are 8 a.m. to 7 p.m., Friday 8 to 5, and Saturday 9 to 3. Memberships start at $46 a month and include all of their brand new equipment, including a water massage bed and tanning bed. They offer personal training, small group training, and specialized classes, all taught by certified and professional trainers. Stop in today and sign up for a membership. All right, welcome back to Cook Bison TV. Bison getting it in here. Wire's going to get it to Stewart. Stewart gives it back to Wire and over to Matson. Matson dribbles it inside, takes a step back. Now try, tries to find Keller. Going to be off of her foot. Now it's going to be Indians ball. And uh, number 23, Velasic, goes up for the shot. JC up blocks. It's going to be a jump ball. Cook Bison going to get the ball now. Wire throwing it in here. Finds Matson. Indians trying to get the ball back. And it's going to be another jump ball. So it's going to be Broken Bow's ball here now. All right, Staples going to be passing it in here for Broken Bow. Finds number 30. She puts it up for two. That's going to be good. And now Indians are going to get the ball back after a sloppy pass. They try to put it up, and the ball just keeps going. And they call a timeout. One of their players was on the floor, so call it a short timeout. Uh, we're going to take one, another little break here, and we'll be right back. New Anytime Fitness Gym, located at 204 Norris Avenue, downtown McCook, is a prime location if you're looking to improve your strength or health. They are open 24 hours a day, every day. Staffed hours for Monday through Thursday are 8 a.m. to 7 p.m., Friday 8 to 5, and Saturday 9 to 3. Memberships start at $46 a month and include all of their brand new equipment, including a water massage bed and tanning bed. They offer personal training, small group training, and specialized classes, all taught by certified and professional trainers. Stop in today and sign up for a membership. The new anytime. All right, welcome back to McCook Bison TV. It's going to be Indians ball here after that little scruffle. 24 gets it into Staples. Staples brings it over here, gets it to Kaylin Scott. Now back to Staples. Staples trying to find somebody past two, gets it back to Scott. Scott's going to dribble in, puts it up for two. Off the rim, no good. Uh, Hanson almost got the rebound, but did not end up doing so. Now Staples has the ball back here, top of the key. 24 Scott, or Kaya Scott had it. Now she's going to take the three-point shot off the rim, no good. And uh, they get the rebound, but Bison end up getting it back after a uh, bad pass. Now Keller brings it down, loses control of the ball. Indians get their hand on it, but goes out of bounds, so it's going to be Bison ball here. Three substitutions here for Broken Bow. All right, Bison uh, passes the ball in here. Wire has the ball. Gets it into JC Hansen. Now Hansen gives it out to Matson. She's going to put the three. That's going to be no good. Nice job, 
Indians get the ball running all the way down the court, put up the layup, but they miss it. Matson with the rebound on that one. All right. Uh, wire top of the key. Gets it over to number 20. The bison now back over to Matson. Matson gets it back to wire. They're going to get it into Keller. Now back to wire. Now into JC Hansen. Can't get anything going here. Finally, wire dribbles up. Dribbles up the middle, puts up the shot, but it's going to be no good. Number 30 coming in for number 44, the Broken Bow Indians. Wire going to be passing it in here for the Bison. Finds Matson at the top of the key. Matson trying to find somebody to pass to. Back to Wire into Keller. Keller puts up the shot, and that's going to be good. First attempt and shot made of the game for Keller. Now Staples. Now over to Velasic. Top of the key here, trying to make something happen. Now Back over to Kaya. Scott, she puts it up. And she's going to nail the two-pointer. Now wire for the Bison finds Keller. She's going to have a little bit of dribbling room here. Gets down the court. Now back to wire. Takes up the middle. Gets it over to Hanson. Hanson puts it up. That's going to be no good. Off the rim. All right. Now Keller is going to put it up. Draws the foul and makes... The basket. Potential three point play here if she gets this uh, free throw. Keller puts it up and it's going to be good, so she gets a three point uh, play out of that. Now Staples for Broken Boat, bringing it up. Gets over to Velasic. Now back to Staples. Back over to Velasic now into number 34. Back out to Kaya Scott, now to Staples. Back over to Scott. Now Staples over to Velasic. They're just kind of passing back and forth here. Now number 34 dribbles in, up the middle, puts it up, and it's going to be no good. J.C. Hansen with the rebound. All right, now Wire for the Bison puts it up. Going to draw the foul. So she's going to be going to the line on that one. First shot is up and good for Olivia Wire. Second shot up, and it's going to be no good. Number 24 with the rebound. Kaya Scott bringing it up, finds Velasic. Now over to Staples. Now back over to Velasic. Was looking to get the shot off, but Wire was there to stop her in time. Staples with a couple pump fakes there. Now gets it in the 34. Now back out to Staples. She's going to hit the three, and off the rim, no good. Now Velasic looking to take a shot, takes a side step, puts up the two-pointer, no good. Uh, I guess that wasn't out of bounds. Now Velasic brings it up the middle here. J.C. Hansen tips the ball, though. And that was off the hands of the Bison, so it's going to stay down here. Uh, Indians ball. All right, Staples passing in here for the Broken Bow Indians. Finds Kaya Scott at the top of the key, takes a three-pointer, no good. Now it's going to be jump ball. 
It was in the hands of Emma Keller. But an Indian came over, grabbed on the ball, forced a jump ball. Now number five, Brooke Stewart, going to be coming in for number one, Peyton Doucette. All right, Keller passing it in here for the Bison. Finds number 20. Uh, back to Keller. Dribbles it a little bit, and that's going to be the buzzer. So that's going to be it for the half. Indians up 20 to 18 over the Bison. And um, we are going to take a break, listen to our advertisements, and we'll be back and with, with some stats for you guys. So thank you for watching McCook Bison TV. We'll be right back. Are you ready to change your lifestyle? McCook Clinic's new weight loss program, Ideal Protein, can help you do just that. Like us on Facebook or call for more information. McCook Clinic, 308-344-4110. Here at KRD Federal Credit Union, we offer in-store services with our lobby hours from 9 to 4 and our drive through hours from 8 to 5, Monday through Friday. We now offer home banking 24-7. So you can check your balance, transfer money between accounts, Plus, our e-making is easy, secure, and just can't get more affordable. It's free. Come and join the family at Carity Federal Credit Union located at 1001 West B Street in McCook. For more information, visit us at www.krd-fcu.org. We are for people, not profit. When you need care right away, choose McCook Clinic. Take advantage of our urgent care hours Monday through Friday from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Saturday 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. or call for an appointment. McCook Clinic. 308-344-4110. The all-new Copper Mill Steakhouse located on the beautiful Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook, Nebraska. Good times with good friends. Just look at this place. Take a look at this lounge. How about this food? Look at this deck. Your hosts, Adam Siegfried and Ryan Fuller, guarantee you a good time with good friends at the Copper Mill Steakhouse on Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook. By switching to McCook National Bank and having a Bison Affinity Card, five cents of every signature-based purchase will be donated to McCook Public Schools. Since inception in July 2017, we have given more than $1,213.70 to McCook Public Schools. By using the Bison Affinity Card, the money raised will go to making McCook Public Schools a better learning center for generations to come. Put one in your wallet today. For more information about the Bison Affinity Card, please call our business number or visit our website. Bocook National Bank is an equal housing lender. Member FDIC. How is your business doing with brand recognition? Here at Acme Printing, we have lots of promotional products for you to try and receive continual recognition from those who see your name on a product. From pens to flashlights or flash drives to power banks, we have you covered. We also produce logos and websites for many different businesses. Come in today and let us help you find the right product for your business here at Acme Printing of McCook. Are your cattle stuck by one water tank? Do you have areas in your pasture the cattle won't graze? Then look no further than Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching. You will install new water lines to get your cattle utilizing your entire pasture and putting on more pounds. And we'll repair your existing livestock and irrigation water lines. Whether it be livestock or irrigation water systems, give us a call. Here at Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching, we have decades of experience and warranty our work for two years on new installations. Give us a call at 308-278-2720. We build it right the first time. Welcome to First Central Bank of McCook. Here you get small town service with big city diversity. We strive to meet your every banking need. To further increase your convenience, we have a four lane drive through mobile banking, and 24 7 ATM services. Or let us help you in person at 904 North Highway 83. First Central Bank, let's plan for tomorrow together. Member FDIC. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. Welcome to the sports shop in downtown McCook. Here we have all your Nebraska Husker apparel needs as well as your local McCook Bison. Providing a variety of shoes for men, women, and children in every sport. The Sports Shop is your store for all things athletic. Come check us out 
at 208 Norris Avenue. We are the name of the game. Here at St. Ertz Bakery, we are one. So join us today on the bricks in downtown McCook and go Bison! Stop by McCook Lettering for any sports apparel you need. Hours are 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Thursday and Saturday 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Stop in today at 306 Norris Avenue or give them a call at 308-345-4812. I graduated high school. A week later, I graduated college with an associate's in business. Now, I'll be able to go to a four-year university entering as a junior. All thanks to the classes I took at Mid Plains Community College. My coursework has almost entirely been online classes. I also took a couple of distance learning classes, which I really liked. It's very exciting to be able to look forward and see where this will take me. Now my opportunities are endless. I have significantly reduced my college debt. I save time, I save money. My ceiling is incredibly high. You can do this. The new Anytime Fitness Gym, located at 204 Norris Avenue, downtown McCook, is a prime location if you're looking to improve your strength or health. They are open 24 hours a day, every day. Staffed hours for Monday through Thursday are 8 a.m. to 7 p.m., Friday 8 to 5, and Saturday 9 to 3. Memberships start at $46 a month and include all of their brand new equipment, including a water massage bed and tanning bed. They offer personal training, small group training, and specialized classes, all taught by certified and professional trainers. Stop in today and sign up for a membership. Are you ready to change your lifestyle? McCook Clinic's new weight loss program, Ideal Protein, can help you do just that. Like us on Facebook or call for more information. McCook Clinic, 308-344-4110. Here at KRD Federal Credit Union, we offer in-store services with our lobby hours from 9 to 4 and our drive through hours from 8 to 5, Monday through Friday. We now offer home banking 24-7. So you can check your balance, transfer money between accounts, Plus, our e-making is easy, secure, and just can't get more affordable. It's free. Come and join the family at Carity Federal Credit Union located at 1001 West B Street in McCook. For more information, visit us at www.krd-fcu.org. We are for people, not profit. When you need care right away, choose McCook Clinic. Take advantage of our urgent care hours Monday through Friday from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. and Saturday 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. or call for an appointment. McCook Clinic. 308-344-4110. The all-new Copper Mill Steakhouse, located on the beautiful Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook, Nebraska. Good times with good friends. Just look at this place. Take a look at this lounge. How about this food? Look at this deck. Your hosts, Adam Siegfried and Ryan Fuller, guarantee you a good time with good friends at the Copper Mill Steakhouse on Heritage Hills Golf Course in McCook. By switching to McCook National Bank and having a Bison Affinity Card, five cents of every signature-based purchase will be donated to McCook Public Schools. Since inception in July 2017, we have given more than $1,213.70 to McCook Public Schools. By using the Bison Affinity Card, the money raised will go to making McCook Public Schools a better learning center for generations to come. Put one in your wallet today. For more information about the Bison Affinity Card, please call our business number or visit our website. McCook National Bank is an equal housing lender. Member FDIC. By switching. All right. Welcome back to... Uh, some girls varsity basketball, McCook versus Broken Bow here tonight. Got some stats for starting um, girls on the McCook Bison side. So JC Hansen, she's made, attempted two uh, shots and made one of them. Uh, attempted two free throws, made one of them. She has six defensive rebounds and one offensive rebound in the first half. Mackenzie Smith. Um, has only attempted one shot, zero made. Uh, attempted two free throws, uh, zero made. Olivia Wire um, attempted five shots, and she has made three of them. Um, she has attempted two free throws, making one of them, and one defensive rebound for her. Um, Brooke Stewart 
has shot three times, has made zero um, of her shots. Uh, Tara Madsen, um, one field or one bat or one shots attempted. Um, also uh, zero made for her um, and two defensive rebounds for her in the first half. All right, halftime coming to an end here. Just a few seconds left. Both teams are getting ready. Uh, start the second half here. Broken Bow up 20 to 18 over the Bison. Very close game. And Indians are going to get the ball to start the second half. Staples is going to bring it down the court here. Now Velasic with the ball gets over to Kaya Scott. Hands it off to her. She's going to give it right over to Staples. Staples finds Velasic. Now back to Staples over to Kaya Scott. Now she finds number 44 down at the bottom. Almost loses the ball out of bounds, but gets it back. Manages to get it to number 34. Now back up to Kaya Scott. Shoots the three, and that's going to be... No good. Number 50, J.C. Hansen with the rebound. Or sorry, number 50, Mackenzie Smith with the rebound. Uh, number five, Brooks Stewart with the layup, and that is going to be good. Now it is tied 20 to 20. Now Vlasic, top of the key here, finds Kaya Scott. Now back to Staples. Staples back to Velasic now, back to Staples. Staples takes up the middle, puts up the two-point shot off the rim, no good. Mackenzie Smith with the rebound. Now Matson with the ball. Finds Olivia Wire. Wire gets it clear down the court to Hanson, and Hanson is going to find Brooke Stewart right at the bottom of the basket there, and she's going to put it up for two. Now Indians bring it down here. Velasic with the ball, trying to find a teammate to... Uh, Pass it to. Finds 44, and that's going to be a foul on number 50. Mackenzie Smith with the push. So it's going to stay down here. Indians ball. Staples going to be throwing in the ball here. All right, Staples trying to find a teammate here. Finds number 34. Four finds Velasic at the top of the key. Now over to Kaya Scott. Scott finds Staples. Now back over to Velasic. She's going to shoot the three-pointer, and that's going to be good. Now by some ball. Wire finds uh, Keller. Now Keller looking for someone to pass to. Defenders all over, and uh, Bice is going to call it timeout to get her out of that situation. We're going to take a quick timeout here. For a quick break along with this time out here, we'll be right back with McCook Bison TV. McCook National Bank and having a Bison Affinity Card, five cents of every signature-based purchase will be donated to McCook Public Schools. Since inception in July 2017, we have given more than $1,213.70 to McCook Public Schools. By using the Bison Affinity Card, the money raised will go to making McCook Public Schools a better learning center for generations to come. Put one in your wallet today. For more information about the Bison Affinity Card, please call our business number or visit our website. McCook National Bank is an equal housing lender. Member FDIC. By switching to McCook National. All right, welcome back here. Bison ball here. Keller gets it to Matson. Now back to Keller. Now back to Matson. Trying to break the Indians' press here. They find Stewart, then down to Hanson. Now Wire's going to take the two-point shot, and that's going to be in. Awesome press break there uh, by the Bison. Now Indians ball here. Lassic trying to find a teammate. Dribbles the ball in. They're going to take the two-point shot. Going to be no good. Terry Matson gets the rebound. Now Wire taking the ball down. Loses the ball, but gets it back. Now Stewart gives it back to Wire. And they're going to call a foul on number 12, Staples of the Broken Bow Indians. Number 40, Kaylin Scott coming in for number 24, Kaya Scott. All right, Wire gets it to Keller. Keller with some defenders, gets the ball back to Wire. Wire dribbles it in, takes a two-point shot, and she does make it. 
Bison up 26-23, just a three-point lead here over the Indians. Staples brings it down, finds uh, Caitlin Scott. She's going to put up no good. Now Bison get the ball back. Wire taking it down, trying to get a layup here, but she uh, looks like she stumbled, ended up losing the ball. Now, uh, I'm not sure what happened. Oh, and they're going to call a technical foul on the head coach of the Bison. I think she got a little bit too far out on the court or something. So, number 12, Staples is going to be shooting two here. First shot is up and it <laughs> gets, gets stuck. Gets stuck on the rim. So they're going to have to bring out somebody tall. Looks like head coach of the Nins is going to come out here. What a hero. <laughs> All right. So she's going to be shooting the second shot here. And that's going to be good. All right, Bison up 26-24. All right, Indians get it in. Vlasic going to have time to take the three-point shot, and she's going to nail it. Now Keller gets it into Wire here for the Bison. Now back to Wire. Sorry, back to Keller. Keller finds Matson. Matson was looking to shoot for Brooke Stewart, but it gets uh, tipped off by the Indians. And Staples gets the ball, puts it up for the layup, no good. Uh, looks like she w uh, did get fouled there, so she's going to be shooting two. First shot is no good. Shot number two here. That's going to be no good. Or sorry, that is going to be good. Now Indians with a two-point lead here over the Bison as Bison get the ball down the court here. Matson dribbles it in. Uh, gets tripped up there. Gets it back to Doucette, though. Now Keller going to put up the shot. No good off the rim. Now uh, Wire gets a rebound off of there. Now Matson gets it to Keller. Keller puts it up. Off the backboard and rim, no good. Number 34 of the Indians. Neely gets a rebound. Indians get it down court. Now Vlasic has the ball. Now to Staples. Wide open three-point shot, no good. Off front of the rim. And the Indians get the ball back in. But it goes directly to Wire, but she travels. So now it's going to be Indians ball. All right, Staples bringing the ball in here for the Indians. Staples hands it off to Vlasic. Now Vlasic gets it over to Staples. She's going to take the baseline and then gets it to Kaylin Scott. And then gets it to number 44, Cyborn, and she's going to put it up for the two-pointer, and it's good. All right, now Matson bringing the ball down here for the Bison. Going to be tipped off. And Indians are covering it here. Number 12, Staples bringing the ball down. Kaylin Scott now going to shoot the three, and that's going to be good. Now Wire trying to break this press here. Finds number 21, Matson. Now Matson is going to find Hanson. Now to do set, she's going to take the layup, and it's going to be off the rim, no good. Both teams fighting for the rebound. Ends up going out of bounds off the hands of the Indians or off the hands of the Bison, so it's going to be Indians ball here. Number 24, Kia Scott coming in here for number 12, Staples. All right, now Velasic bringing the ball down for the Indians. Hands it off to Kia. Kia Scott, now Kaylin Scott with the ball. Must be sisters or related or something. Now over to Velasic. Gets it in the 34 Neely. And then gets it over to Kaylin Sky who takes a three-point shot. No good. Now Wire up to Cook Bison with the ball. Driving down the courts. Ends up losing control of the ball. 
And it's going to be turned over. Now Kia Scott bringing the ball down here. Going to stop short for the two-point shot, and that's going to be good. Indians uh, bringing on some momentum here uh, late in the third quarter. Period, sorry. Now Bison with the ball. J.C. Hansen going to put up the two-point shot off the backboard. No good. Neely with the rebound. Now Velasic gets it down to Kia Scott off her hands. Ends up getting the ball back, though. Now Velasic dribbling up. Uh, left the le Bison left the lane wide open, and they're lucky uh, she didn't get that um, shot in the basket. Bison with the ball now. Wire tries to find Doucette. But off her hands, and now it's going to be Bison ball, or Indians ball, sorry. Now Velasic bringing the ball down, finds Kaylin Scott, going to take the three-pointer off the rim, no good. Now Kia Scott taking the two-pointer, also no good. Jesse Hansen with the rebound. Now Doucette going to try to bring the ball down here. Going to be shooting the layup here, and that's going to be a uh, foul on the Indians, number 44, Cassidy Cyborn. So she's going to be shooting two here. Number one, Peyton Doucette. First shot up, and it's going to be no good. Brooklyn Boat Indians up 35 to 26 here with just a minute 20 left to go in the third period. Pitney set with her second shot, and that's going to be good. Now, Staples of the Indians bringing the ball in here. Kia Scott looks to take a shot, but gives it back to Staples instead. Now, number 20, um, Meston takes a sh shot, no good. Jesse Hansen with a rebound. Tries to get over to Brolin Morgan, but that's going to be no good. Now Kia Scott of the Indians gets it over to Staples. Staples gives it back over to Kia. Kia takes a shot. That's going to be no good. Both teams fighting for the rebound here. Uh, it's going to end up being a jump ball. See who gets the ball here. And it's going to be the Indians. Sorry, no, it's going to be the Bison. And McKellar passing it in here for the McCook Bison. She finds number 10, Brolin Morgan. And Morgan finds Miller, gives it over to uh, Hanson, and then Doucette with the uh, layup there. Also gets fouled. Going to be shooting one shot here. Pretty good play there uh, by the Bison to find Doucette down there. Oh, looks like she actually traveled before her layup, so there was no shot. But number 40, Kaylin Smith gets a fast break, ends up missing the layup. And then Kia Scott gets it, puts up the shot, also no good. And they're going to call a foul on um, the Indians here. 19 seconds left here in the third period. Indians up 35 to 27 over the Bison. All right, Emma Kelly here for the Bison, gonna pass in the ball. She finds Brillin Morgan. Morgan finds Wire. Wire looking to pass here, finds Morgan again. Morgan finds Doucette, and it looks like she's gonna give it to Hanson. And she puts up for the layup. That was a perfect press break uh, textbook definition there. That was really, really a nice smooth play there by the Bison. Now Kia Scott puts up the last minute three-pointer and she's gonna get it. All right, Indians up 38, 29, 38 to 29 over the McCook Bison. We're gonna take a quick break here. We will be right back with McCook Bison TV. Are your cattle stuck with? How is your business doing with brand recognition? Here at Acme Printing, we have lots of promotional products for you to try and receive continual recognition from those who see your name on a product. From pens to flashlights or flash drives to power banks, we have you covered. We also produce logos and websites for many different businesses. Come in today and let us help you find the right product for your business here at Acme Print of McCook. 
Are your cattle stuck by one water tank? Do you have areas in your pasture the cattle won't graze? Then look no further than Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching. You will install new water lines to get your cattle utilizing your entire pasture and putting on more pounds. And we'll repair your existing livestock and irrigation water lines. Whether it be livestock or irrigation water systems, give us a call. Here at Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching, we have decades of experience and warranty our work for two years on new installations. Give us a call at 308-278-2720. We build it right the first time. Are your cattle stuck? All right, welcome back to McCook Bison TV here. At McCook High School tonight with some girls varsity basketball. Broke a boat, Indians up 38-29 over the McCook Bison. Staples bringing up the court here, gets it over to Velasic. Now Kaya Scott almost takes a shot, decides not to. Now Staples goes back to Scott. She gives it number 44, bounces off of her head. And Jacia Hansen is okay the ball, but oh, Velasic gets her hand in the way of that pass and gets ends up putting up a two-pointer layup for the Indians. Now Morgan with the ball finds Doucette. Now she's gonna find Keller. Trying to break this Indians press here. And that's gonna be off the hands of the Indians. Buy some ball here. Livy Wire passing it in. Wire gets it into Morgan. Now do set top of the key, gets it over to Morgan again. Now Morgan's gonna take the three point shot and that's gonna be a little bit short, no good. Staples brings it down, gonna find number 44, wide open. At the other basket, puts up for two, that's gonna be good. Indians starting to find a little bit of a lead here early in the fourth period. And number 34 fouls for the Indians, so it's going to be Bison ball here. Number 30, Emma Keller passing in here for the Bison. Finds Doucette. Oop, Doucette dribbles it off the opponent's foot. And it goes out of bounds. Indians ball here. Number 24, Kia Scott. Passing it in here for the Indians. Staples finds Vlasic. Now back to Staples. Staples taking it up the middle. Takes one too many steps and gets called for travel. So that shot is no good. By some ball here. Keller passes it in to Stewart. Now back to Keller. Keller off Keller's hand. Vlasic ends up getting the ball back, puts it up for two. Now back to Keller, now to Stewart for the Bison. Taking some risky passes here. Wire gets, puts it up for two, no good off the rim. Now Staples brings it down for the Indians. A little bit of fast, fast break action. Gets slowed up though, now Vlasic wide open for the three. That is gonna be no good off the rim. Now Kia Scott putting it up for three off the back of the rim, no good. And that's gonna be out on the Broken Bow Indians. Bison gonna get the ball here. Number 50 coming in for number 52, JC Hansen. Indians with a 44 to 29 lead here with just six minutes left in the fourth period. Now Stewart gets the ball for the Bison, turns over right away. And then Wire actually gets her hands on the ball. And it's gonna be a foul on somebody. And that's gonna be called on the Broken Bow Indians. Wire gonna be passing in the ball here like usual. Gets it into Stewart. So we're looking for a teammate, finds Doucette. Now over to Keller, takes a two point shot. That's gonna be over shot, no good. Kia Scott with the rebound. Now Kaylin Scott down here at the, under, at the end of the uh, other end of the court here. Now Vlasic puts up the two pointer and she's gonna get that. Now Wire gets in the deuce set and we're gonna have a timeout by the McCook Bison. We're gonna take a short little break here. Thank you for watching McCook Bison TV. We'll be right back. One water tank? Do you have areas in your pasture the cattle won't graze? Then look no further than Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching. 
You will install new water lines to get your cattle utilizing your entire pasture and putting on more pounds. And will repair your existing livestock and irrigation water lines. Whether it be livestock or irrigation water systems, give us a call. Here at Morehouse Irrigation and Trenching, we have decades of experience and warranty our work for two years on new installations. Give us a call at 308-278-2720. We build it right the first time. Are your cattle stuck with... Welcome to First Central Bank of McCook. Here you get small town service with big city diversity. We strive to meet your every banking need. To further increase your convenience, we have a four-lane drive through mobile banking, and 24-7 ATM services. Or let us help you in person at 904 North Highway 83. First Central Bank, let's plan for tomorrow together. Member FDIC. Emma it's Keller? It's not Kaler. It is not. Hello, welcome back to McCook Bison TV. Uh, Virgo Indians, 46 to 29 lead over the Bison. Wire gets into Stewart, now over to Doucette. Uh, finds Keller down at the baseline. Keller trying to find a teammate, finds Stewart. Stewart takes a baseline, puts it up for two, gets fouled. She's gonna be shooting two uh, shots here. Stewart puts up the shot, and that's going to be good. Second shot going up for Stewart. That's going to be good as well. Now Randall coming in for Stewart. Kia Scott gets it in the stables for Broken Bow. Staples trying to f make a move on set. Gets a pass to number 34. Tries to hit uh, Scott down at the baseline. Gets interrupted though and then uh, there's gonna be a foul called. Foul called on uh, the Indians. Olivia Wire, number 33, gonna be shooting some free points here. This is going to be one and one here. First shot is up. No good off the rim. Uh, Keller got the rebound right away. Put it up. No good. And then Smith got the rebound. Also puts it up. No good as well. Indians finally get it back. Staples bringing it down here. Finds Kalen Scott. Thinks about taking a shot. Decides not to. Now Velasic dribbles it up the middle. Gets it back to Kalen. And Kia tries to make a uh, pass to Velasquez, but Wire gets her hand in there. Going to be out of bounds, so it's going to be Indians ball here. Now Staples finds number 34. Back to Staples off of her toe. Out of bounds. Going to be Bison ball here. Just under five minutes left to go in the game. Indians up 46 to 31 over the Bison. Now Randall uh, finds Smith at half court off of her hands. Uh, Kia Scott got the ball off of that, but um, there's a foul on the Bison, I do believe. Now number 44, Casti Cyborin passing it in here for the Indians. Find Staples, Doucette with the coverage. Gets by her, gets it up the middle, decides to give it to Velasic. Now Velasic to Cyborin, and she's gonna put up for two, that's gonna be good. Bison trying to break the Indians press here. Randall gets it to Wire over half court. Wire stops short, puts up the two pointer, no good, out of bounds now on the Indians, so it's gonna be Bison ball. Wire passing it in for the Bison. Wire finds Doucette wide open, takes a two point shot off the back of the rim, no good. Cassie Cyborn with the um, rebound there. And they're gonna call a foul for a reach on Livia Wire. It's 
Cyborg passing in here for the Ogle Broken Bow Indians. Staples finds a little bit of dribbling room. Stop short for the two-point shot. Puts it up and succeeds. Wire passing it in now for the Bison. Gives it to Zou Doucette. She gives it right back. Now Randall puts it up for two, and that's going to be good. Bison trying to get a little bit of momentum going here late in the game. Now Staples finding Kalen Scott. Now over to Velasic, top of the key here. Tries to hit Kalen again, but off of her hand, out of bounds. Going to be Bison ball. Wire sends, Wire gets it into Smith. Now Smith over to Doucette. Doucette gets it across half court. That finds Wire again. Gets it to Smith, but it's going to be tipped by the Indians. Now Indians ball. Finds Kia Scott wide open down uh, at the other court. Indians uh, fans want a foul there. Looked like Keller got her foot um, kind of in the way there. Tripped her up a little bit, but Wire gets it in the deuce set here. Doucette going to take it down the court. Now over to Wire. Wire's going to shoot the three-pointer. Off the back of the rim, no good. Now Staples bringing it down. Finds Kia Scott. She's going to put it up for two, and that's going to be good. Now Doucette. Brings the ball down. Randall puts it up for two. No good. Smith gets a rebound, though. Puts it right back up. And that's going to be good. Kia Scott bringing the ball down this time. And foul called on Livia Wire of McCook. That is Livia Wire's third foul of the game. All right, Kia Scott gets it in to Kalen Scott. Kalen brings the ball down, finds number 20. Now back over to Kia. Back over to Meston now. Now Kalen Scott had the ball, looks like it went out of bounds. Must have went off the Bison's foot or something. All right, Meston throwing the ball in now here for the Indians. Finds Kia. Kia puts it up for two. Going to be off the rim, no good. Kia gets her own rebound and finds Kalen at the top of the key. Over to Weston. Wets, Wets 10. Now Cyborn with the ball gets it to Kia. Kia takes a three-point shot. No good. JC Hansen with the rebound. Now Doucette going to try to take it down for the Bison. Emma Keller had the ball, ends up losing it. Now Kia puts up the two-point shot. No good. Now Cyborn puts up the two-point shot. Going to be no good, but she draws the foul. Going to be shooting two points here now. That foul's on number 52, J.C. Uh, Hansen. <laughs> Cyborn puts up first shot. That's going to be good. Cyborn with her second shot. That is going to be good as well. <laughs> now, 
Now number 20, Randolph for the Bison, thrown in the ball. Finds Doucette. Doucette bringing the ball down, finds uh, Wilcox. And then gets it to Miller below the basket, puts it up, no good. Now Indians, number five, brings it in, puts up a two-point shot, overshoots it, no good. Number 14, Alyssa Cyborn with the rebound, but ends up taking it out of bounds, so it's going to be Bison Ball. Randolph throwing it in here, finds Doucette. Doucette finds Miller. And she finds Elsa Wilcox, then back to Doucette. Randolph finds uh, Brilla Morgan with a three-point shot. In and out of the basket, no good. Doucette gets a rebound, puts it back up. Going to be blocked by number 30 of the Indians, Emma Shaw. Throw it uh, down the court. Bison get their hand on it, out of bounds. Now number 10, Lindsay Shada bringing in the ball for the Indians. She finds number five. Now down to number four. Gets under the basket, but ends up falling. Gets the ball over back to number five, and gonna be over and back on the Indians. Gonna be Bison ball now. Just 24 seconds left here in the game. Morgan finds Randolph for the Bison. We're going to hit Stewart. Now back to Wilcox. And back to Stewart. Stewart tries to take it to the baseline. Dribbles the out of bounds. Indians ball. Number 10 for the Indians finds number 5. Morgan with the coverage here. Finds number 25 now. Shoots the ball. Going to be blocked by... Miller, and that's going to be the end of the game. Final score is 54 to 35. Indians, uh, Broken Bow, end up winning it. We are going to take a little break here, and then we will be back with the men's varsity um, game. So thank you for watching the Cook Bison TV. We'll see you in a little bit. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 or stop in today during their business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. at 304 North Avenue in McCook. 
Garrison's for Men has a wide selection of men's clothing to meet all of your needs. Need to rent a tux for prom? Garrison's for Men has you covered. Call 308-345-7247 